Hey Jory, hey Mermaid Jeans. I will be with y'all in a hot second. I just needed to refresh my coffee and get some water. So BRB. Also, my bathroom sink is still clogged. I'm trying one more time with Jory now and then I have to put in a ticket. No worries. Hey, Queen. Hey, Adi. Remind me how to pronounce your username, because I'm the worst. Okay. Hey, guess what? Sorry, I had to go get all the things. She's like, I'm just gonna do a giveaway. And then, are you ready to do the giveaway? Absolutely not. You're ready to do anything? No. Otterina, how does Theo say it? Oh, there's my controller on the floor. Any cuss of it. Aha, there you are. Oh, with a French accent. Sorry about no second stream yesterday. This cold really said you you shall not pass. Hey Fernando, thank you so much. Seven years of being a Twitch partner and almost ten years of streaming, y'all. Where did the time go? All right, I forgot what we're doing. It was just yesterday. Also, thank you to EA for my copy. Hashtag EA partner. I tried to fight the Gate of Deep Sorrows. That was a that was a bad idea. All right. There's Lonnie. Thank you. How's everyone doing? Hey, dragons. Ah, we have to go to Treviso. Hey, mermaid jeans. Thank you for the gift subs. Hey, 
Thanks, y'all. I can't believe seven years as a partner, let alone ten years Fewer on this people than I expected. platform. Let's find Asher. Asher? The Viper. He prefers to be called Asher in private. Said I could tell you. Ah, s <gasps> hold on. There's a dog. I don't care about you. Hold on. There's a dog. Hey, Farwick. Thank you. There's a dog. I, I don't care. Trouble in the Unvalenim. Darkspawn. But those tunnels are safe passage for... I know. We've had to close uh, that entrance. Apparently that is Matt Mercer. Uh -huh. No time to waste. Those darkspawn have to be destroyed before they get out into the city. If you get through, signal the all clear at the hidden door. Raining again. Oh? This is troubling. Darkspawn in the city. And in one of the worst places. Talk to Lorelei. She's the boss. All right. I'm Hector. I watch the front. Make sure things are quiet. Rook. Good to hey meet Frost. you. Thank you. Be careful hey, Sleazy. Oh, thank you. Sorry, do I know you? Oh, hold on. Oh, okay. the Unvalenim should have an entrance this way. The passage is hidden by a wall carving. Keep an eye out. Oh, oh. oh right always. Got you covered. Now's your chance. Oh, got us from a distance. Oop, calling myself. Hey, Jory. There. Is that the wall carving you mentioned? That's the one. There's a switch behind the serpent's head on the left. How you feeling, Jory? How was your stream? I, uh... My body said you shall not do anything extra. Got it. No worries. Thanks for being here. Like the ossuary, but without the view. Ah, uh, yes. There's definitely blight down here. Oh, blight. Oh. Don't like the sound of that. Oh, Can't blight. Get here. But we've got to clear the obstacle somehow. The sound of the blight is disgusting. That did it. We can get through now. Oh no. Shadow Dragon agents. They're down here with us. Get them. They'll run for reinforcements. Reinforcements. We can't let them reach the Shadow Dragon hideout. Even more Venatori? We have to take out the leaders. Not too bad. Oh, so much health down here. Eyes open. Ugh. The dark spawn will not stop until we get rid of the blight pools. Blocked. There's another boil somewhere. Oh, dark spawn. I demand more. Got us in a distance. 
He did not say. Is this something early game? Jory, do you mind sending me a message on what it is? Oof. Those darkspawn of Veditori were on the same side. I know, and I don't like it. Darkspawn usually hate all life. At least that seems to be the last of them. You sure? Wouldn't be a warden if I wasn't. It should be safe for the shadows to use the entrance again. Let's find it and tell them to open up. Hey, Kelly. Hope work is going well. There we go. Yes, yeah, say I was trying to lurk in same stream, but they're already ahead of me, and I'm like, damn, how much did you play? There it is, a hidden entrance back into the shop. Nice. It's Rook. All clear down here. Nice work. Thank you. The door. Hey. Good that you're still standing. Best let Asher know. Cool, cool. How far How are did you? Did the Venatori find the Shadow Dragon's hideout? Isn't it a secret? We helped the people in Docktown. They know where we are. Someone might have talked about the shop. People spreading rumors. That's easy to. Help. Okay. But Darkspawn, that's different. really saved our skins there, Rook. Those Darkspawn could have destroyed us. It wasn't just Darkspawn. Venatori were there too, and they weren't fighting each other. How is that possible? Darkspawn attack all living things. Darkspawn are blighted. If the gods control the blight, they might control the Darkspawn. Okay. Darkspawn or Venatori makes no difference. You'll defeat them all. If you're looking for answers about the Venatori, I oh. may have a lead. A warehouse on the other side of the city. Lots of cult activity. And some of them were spotted headed towards a shop. Could be a coincidence, or it could be something more. It's worth a look. Agreed. Rook, let's go. Game's like, nah, you're doing this mission. The Viper, or Asher, I suppose. Is he the leader of the Shadow Dragons? One of them. He made his name freeing slaves and supporting their rebellions. He won't stop until slavery ends in Tevinte. So the Viper's real name is Asher? A middle name. He calls himself Viper for first impressions. Or so he says. What do you mean? Asher just doesn't have the same impact, does it? Ooh. Oh, that does fire damage?
Ooh. Uh, I will come back for you that. You know what you're off then. Oh, this works now. Cool. Hey, Robert. Hey, Selena. How are you? Selena, what is your actual wedding? I just want Benatori, we're close. What up, Benatori? Thank you. More Benatori. Guards, probably. You bastard! Hold still. Oh, you got a crystal? Oh, we gotta fix that. Ah, shit. Absolutely not. Oh my god, I cuss at everybody. Excuse you? My job, son. Your turn. Ooh. Just making sure I didn't miss any green pots, because that was an ass whooping. Oh, there's a green pot. I cussed everybody. There we go. Someone locked. Mm, there has to be another way in. Ah, oh, harp. I gotta like it leaves in it. Let's in a draft. Sorry, I'm not super chatty. I'm also just sniffling and it is driving me up a wall. Oh, I've been up here. Never mind. Oh, 
Or have I? Oh, I guess I was going the right way. Wait, this is just where I was, isn't it? It is. Whoops. I guess we did need to climb the ladder. Lots of Venatori. We must be close. I'll make this quick. Got it covered. Take this shot. That's all the Venatori guarding the place. Right. Here's our way in. Wow, the Venatori just leave windows open and shit. when I hear one, and I know they hate being interrupted. This is not dark spawn. How? We stop them, then we figure it out. Wait, how did y'all get in here? Oh, I went entirely the wrong way. So what's everyone up to other than Veil Guard for a lot of us? Get ready. They're controlling Dark Spawn. The Vincent never yields! Why would anyone even want Dark Spawn? That's all of the Darkspawn and Venatori. Let's search the place and figure out what they were doing. Ooh. I keep trying to do the search function from Inquisition. Look at this. Draining into the tunnels below the city, perhaps. One more way, the Venatori Ooh, will nice. the light into our tunnels. I'll tell the other shadows. Ooh, what you painting? I'm nosy. What you painting? Oh! The Venatori are in bed with the... Oh, shit. Hey. This note. Knight Commander Lenos of the Minrathus Templars is being paid off by Venatori. Damn it. Oh. Seriously, DA2 has taught us that lesson. Sorry, I'm having some applesauce because I'm five.
Okay, but what? Oh wait, there's something I missed. This explains the darkspawn we keep finding in the catacombs. At least they don't know where the shadow dragons are. Exactly. Gave the Venatoria relic they can use to control Darkspawn. Hey, Rook. Is everything all right in there? Rook, I thought I'd see if you needed help. Where fuck were you? Did you find anything in there? The Risen Gods taught the Venatori how to control Darkspawn. Explains why the hideout was attacked. We found documents from the Knight Commander. I knew he was crooked. I didn't think he was actually Venatori. Let's head back to the shop. We'll discuss things there. I like that the game just sent us back and we didn't have to run there. Hold on, there's a dog pet. There's a dog to pet, I don't care. You managed to catch the stragglers fleeing the warehouse. They'll think twice before coming back here. What else did you find? The Venatori serve Elganarn and Gilanin like we thought. They gave the cult control over Darkspawn. Great. Sounds like the Venatori are going to be even more trouble. <sighs> Is there something I can do? The Risen Gods are my responsibility too. How do we know we can even trust you? You're not from here. <laughs> You don't know Minrathus like we do. And we know as little about you as we do these risen gods you unleashed. Wow. Now, now. What is it they say? The enemy of my enemy is my friend. <gasps> my purse! The cult has its hooks deep in the city. Venatory backers sit in the magisterium chambers. And now they wield power given to them by the gods. Holy shit! We'll have to get along if there's any chance of surviving this. May, what are you doing here? You promised you'd lay low. Tried it, didn't much care for it. Oh shit. Oh shit. I was wondering if she'd show up. Nice to meet you. I'm Rook. There's trouble in Minrathis, Venatori, and Risen Gods. Rook's helping us with it. Mavaris is one of the Shadow Dragon leaders. Mavaris Talani, formerly Magister Mavaris Talani, at your service. Wait, formally? My enemies conspired to have my Magisterium seat stripped for me. We can talk about it later, if you want. My concerns feel petty when stacked against risen gods. The Shadow Dragons have a lot to discuss, but you, Rook, are expected at the Swan. Me? The Cobbled Swan? Why? The First Warden is here to speak with you. The First Warden? Let's hope we actually get some help with the Blight. Come back when you can. I think we'll need your help again. Oh, so first cameo. First cameo. Okay. Venatory spot somewhere uptown. I know someone in the area who's keeping what. Watch. 
find him in the library. Say you're looking for Ferdinand Genetivi's book on Orlay. Oh, no. Ferdinand Genetivi? He's a Ferelden scholar. Virtually unknown in the north, and no one ever asks about his work. Oh, a passphrase. Got it. <laughs> Spotted any more darkspawn? Not close to the shop, but we're keeping alert. We haven't seen the end of them. Selena, did you watch all the credits for Inquisition when you finished? How did you join the Shadow Dragons? Helped make the Templars look the other way when there was a slave rebellion going down. Okay. Turned out that the Viper was helping. He brought me on. That venatory stunt with the Darkspawn has me dreading what's to come. Warden training taught me that when you spot a Darkspawn, there's at least 20 more hiding nearby. Oh, meeting with the first warden. This is going to be interesting. They're telling us to watch out for the dogs. Um, I would say if you well, can, yes, because there's stuff in Inquisition and the DLC that will make a lot more sense when you play this, because there is a slight recap, but not a long recap when you start the game. Or go watch people's playthroughs if you don't have time for it, like watch... Watch someone's playthrough and or someone playing Trespasser DLC to make this make a lot more sense. Welcome to the shop. I'm Lorelei. Anything you need, just ask. Ooh. I think I picked those up. I mean, Selena, you just played Inquisition. How do you feel about that? Do you feel like you need it to... Do you feel like you would get it... You would understand this as much... Ooh. Keep safe out there. I wish you could offer gifts without having to go back home. I feel like that should go to... Wait, where are the Tevinter leathers I just bought? Interesting. Oh, I've got points.
Oh yeah, a sleeping shot. And even coffee? What? I don't know what this does. I just want. I just think because it's there. Hey, Nicasio. <sighs> Did I not buy those? I seriously thought I bought the... There's Saharan. Sorry, I got very excited. What happened? What do you think, Selena? As I thought I bought them. I heard about the warehouse. Darkspawn, huh? Those damned Venatori. Oh, because I would like that appearance. You know what? Let's go back to the lighthouse. Oh, that's interesting. So I like my crow look. So I'm like, I just bought this. What happened? Court, it's annoying basically. Oh, there we are. So I'm like, I just bought these. Oh no, that is not as good as I liked. I don't actually like that now that I have it on. I wish you could try it.
Uh, yes, Rook is the equivalent of your tab. Hey, this is starting to look like home. Let's go talk to Nav. Uh, I would say, Court, if you've never played a Dragon Age game, honestly get and play Inquisition first. I feel like this will make a lot more sense or watch someone's oh, playthrough. Yeah, I just feel like the game will make way more sense if you are, if you have already played, um, Inquisition and the Trespasser DLC first. This was with my things. It looks like your handwriting. I didn't read it. Well... A couple of words. I thought it might be one of mine. I don't even know how it got there. It's those wisps. I need more wards. Oh, I can help with that. I started this. I'll deal with it. I don't know. I think they're cute. So cute. They didn't steal your notes. Maybe they like you. Poor Nev. Do you follow the Chantry? Uh, the Pendant. I noticed it's Andrastian. I barely keep the holidays. It's from an old job. Oh, which one? Maybe I read about it in a Timeter paper. I'm barely in the papers. Oh, but when you are, it's on the edge of something exciting. What about that one story? Oh my god. The Demon, the Diamond, and the Deadbeat Magister. Oh, they mentioned you twice. That was a hit piece. Oh, that's awful. It was against the Magister. I was the footnote. Still. The job got done. Of course, it would have gone smoother, but the client ratted me out to the demon. What? What? It's always something. Funny how that didn't make the print. Tell me you read the rest of the paper, too. Oh, yes. Sometimes they have these stories. Serials. They're thrilling. Except they come out in pieces. <sighs> I only see a few papers a year. I never know how the stories end. Oh, she's so cute. These papers are from Minrathus, right? Hey! I'm guessing there's blood Thank you. murder, tears. That checks out. Who's the second most innocent character? Ten Gold says that they're the killer. What about the most innocent? I don't know. They die? What? Wow! All right, Belle. You get me the name of your serial, I'll try and track the ending. Just don't say we didn't warn you. I'd like to go back anyway. Spend time in Dark Town, pick up gossip. One company? Why not? Ready to go when you are. I'm also being an old lady and getting Vic's vapor rub for my chest. Because I feel old right now.
is on hello thank you oof all right now where are you oh there you are look who's thoughtful I'm going to do that. bought a better bow. Oh. Oh, that is my only special. Oh, wait. I want to know how these people got, like, every companion already, because according to Steam, I've only pay played 10 hours, and I ain't picked up nobody. Oh, Lucanus wants to talk. Oh, that scroll isn't there yet. Damn it. Rogue. Oh, they don't show the... They don't have it on the screen of what your class is. Rook, Ilario sent word. He's got intel on Zara. He wants to meet up. Fancy a trip to Treviso? Sounds like fun. Coffee with the cross. First, let's see what the warden is up to. Yeah, but there are people talk with the whole party, and I'm like, the game just came out Thursday. It, that's where he wants to be, I guess. What is this is going to bother me? I feel like Lucanus has some issues to work out. Oh. I take Harding. I haven't taken her anywhere. And Nev, since I'm not a mage. Right? Well, I was going to take... So, Lucanus has some shit to work out. My man needs whatever Thetis offers as therapy. Oh, I imagine word will spread, eventually. Your enemies won't be pleased. And they'll do what, exactly? They've already ousted me from the Magisterium, and we know they're too cowardly to attempt anything else. A 
Candlehop. They carry messages through the city. Why does everyone call him the Viper? Don't you know? What quest is this? I don't know what quest that is. I'm gonna come back. Found all this myself. Treasure. Don't touch unless you're buying. <laughs> yeah, I haven't looked at IMDb because I don't want to get spoiled. Keep him busy? I'm chasing a fraudulent enchantment scheme. It's harmless until the buyer thinks they're immortal. A doggo. I don't care what else happens. You read the notes on the circle road case? Mobari. Magister's aid? Killed with an arrow instead of magic. Oh! Actually. Stop. The murdered magister's aid killed with an arrow instead of magic. Hard to get an angle like that. It is. Where would you take it from? I don't know the place that well, but there's a tower not far that would get a clean shot and good cover. But if you were angry and in a hurry, if the shot were more lucky than planned, hmm. Well, there's that bridge. Wait, why are you asking me? Oh god, don't say souls warden. Hold on, a cat. Can we not pet you? No, I want to pet the cat. The purr. I think the fire is in the way, so we can't actually walk around and pet it. How dare. Ah, uh, the first warden. I didn't realize we'd get to see the first warden before I now. I am Jowin Glastrum, first warden and supreme commander of Weishaupt. So? I received word of your team's request for Grey Warden assistance after an incursion of the Blight at Demeter's Crossing. Explain yourself, warden. Hey, Gigi. And bear in mind that the Order remembers your past recklessness. Many lives would have been lost if not for my recklessness. AJ. You destroyed a building. Eh. To seal off a darkspawn tunnel to the surface. In defiance of orders. Those orders were wrong, sir. Your report, Junior Warden. 
I was part of a team trying to stop an elven mage named Solus from destroying the Veil. When we disrupted his ritual, something escaped from the Fade, and I clearly sensed the corruption of the Blight. From this mage, Solus? No, sir. Solus opposes the Blight. He's actually an elven god, Fenharel, the Dreadwolf. I did not come here to listen to fairy tales. I am here because of the Blight. Right, but it all ties together. See, when we disrupted the ritual, Solus got trapped in the Fade. But two of the elven gods got out. Elganon and Gilanane, we think. And they're blighted. Why would elven gods be blighted? The ancient elven gods used the Blight. That's why Solus imprisoned them. The point is that the gods are making the Blight worse. Demeter's crossing was just the start. That's why we need the Grey Wardens. I suspected more politicking from the remnants of the Inquisition. Wow. See now that I was wrong. Wow. I'm really glad to hear that. It is clear that whatever you did to unleash the Blight has corrupted your already weak mind. What? Okay, wait. You will be taken to Weishaupt and placed under heavy guard until the danger what? caused by unleashing the Blight passes. <sighs> Excuse me? Absolutely not. That's not gonna happen. I assure you, it will. We don't have time to fight. I need Grey Wardens marching with me, not at me. That's the only way we have a chance to stop the gods and the Blight. Let me tell you something about the Blight. It is evil, it is implacable, and above all, it is predictable. The right? Blight has not changed in over a thousand years. The Grey Wardens will defeat it, as they always do. And we will do so without a disgraced Junior Warden causing needless confusion. I suggest you come along quietly. Adamant Fortress 941, Dragon. The Grey Wardens attempted to raise an- <gasps> Hardly the models of good judgment yourselves, are you? Ah! Everyone knows Warden Commander Clarell acted alone at Adamant Fortress. Acted alone, you say? Imagine if everyone were to see the letter I discovered where you authorize her actions. I wonder how that might complicate the narrative. Are you prepared to risk the security of the Grey Wardens for this deluded girl? You may be surprised to learn that I care very little about the security of the Grey Wardens. Stay away from the Blight and do not pester the Grey Wardens with any more of your nonsense. He seems upset. Was it something I said? I'm sorry. Two characters I wanted to see in one stream so far? That was close. Wasn't looking forward to being dragged off hey, the wooden dungeon. Who should I be thanking for the assist? Magister Dorian Parvis, at your service. A mutual friend thought you might require some support. Mavaris Talani, of the Shadow Dragons. The very same. You all don't understand how fucking excited I am. I just need one more person to show up. Oh my god. You all don't understand. You all do not understand how fucking excited I am. What's your relation to the Shadow Dragons? About a decade ago, Mayvaris and I started a political faction called the Lucerni. We were going to change to Vinter for the better. Is that the same voice Everyone actor? Everyone would recognize the common sense benefits of our approach, and we'd all live happily ever after. I take it that didn't happen. Mayvaris was framed, kicked out of the Magisterium, and the Lucerni were dissolved. So she took the movement underground. The Shadow Dragons. 
Since I still haunt the Magisterium, that makes me the Shadow Dragon's man on the inside. You all have no fucking idea. The First Warden's a problem. If he won't help, I need him to stay out of my way. I'm sure he'll show up again. Like an ulcer. For now, pay him no mind. No Grey Warden worth the name sits in a Menrathus lounge sipping wine. You need the Wardens? Look for the ones out there fighting the Blight. In the meantime, the Shadow Dragons will keep a close watch on the Venatori. Good luck. I'm sure we'll see each other He's even got soon. a stripe of grey. He's even got a stripe of grey. The fuck is this? Only the veil Ow. stood between us in a world of blighted darkness. But on this side, the gods could only tap a trickle. They had to turn that trickle into a flood. They sure could have used Solus's dagger to rip open the Fade. But some foolish mortal had taken it. So, they'd have to create a dagger of their own. <gasps> this explains the pit on the Bioware store. Drowning the world in blight was just a matter of time. I'm sorry if I also sounded like... I saw a mouse instead of Dorian because I realized how high my voice went when I saw him. I need to talk to Varric. In peace, vigilance. If we get to see Anders, I'm going to scream because Anders technically should be dead or on his calling. But since you don't import your choices, does that even matter? And I'm not asking. I'm just like thinking out loud. Uh, Nicasio, the, all the companions names are, are in the ban word list. So... I haven't seen much of you lately. I was getting worried. Everything all right? Wait, that dagger. I've seen it before. Solus was using it at the ritual site. No, uh, before that. Shit, it can't be. Look at it, Rook. I have. Plenty. Ever since it hurt Harding. Remember that story I told you about me and Hawk, Meredith and Orsino? How the trouble hey, started in Kirkwall? On our expedition to the Deep Roads, that's what we found. That's what my brother tried to kill us for. An idol made of red lyrium. That sang a song which drove anyone who heard it mad. Are you sure it's the same thing? Oh, look at it. It's changed. Wow, they went back the to DA2. Size. Same ring at the top. Not to mention, it's pure lyrium. No one, not even the dwarves in Orzammar, work pure lyrium like that. It's too dangerous. If that's true, if this dagger is the red lyrium idol from your story, how did Solus cleanse it of the blight? I, I have no idea. I can't believe you found it. Oh, hey, Rook. I'm not interrupting anything, am I? You seem a little more comfortable with your new abilities. How are you feeling? Things are weird, I don't remember. But I'm adjusting, I think. That's not what I came in here for, though. All right, Harding. What's on your mind? So, the Wardens. I know some. A married couple Varric and I met while we were tracking Solus. I'd almost forgot about that. I really am getting too old for this shit. You think they'll talk to us? After the first warden and everything? It's worth a try. I can write them and hope. Okay. Let's see who's in our corner. 
So that means when we go to Weiss Hop, it's gonna be real interesting. <laughs> Stop fussing over me. Go see what the others are up to. Oh, we have to go to the Anderfels. Fuck this. Oh, is this where we get Davrin? Oh shit. I still wanna know how these people are have every companion. Who do, we, do we take? Who do we take? I'm not really taking Ballara anywhere. Ooh. I wish we had four in the party like in previous games. They have to be, because I think I'm at about, well, the, according to Steam, it's only 10 hours. I don't think that's right. Nope, I'm sick of my party. Okay, I can't destroy those. I mean, there's people who've already put full playthroughs out, including spoiling the ending, and I'm like... Spirit who moves around, or different spirits who will look the same? As needed, Dweller. Right. How are you, Nemo? How are, how's your playthrough going? Because I'm sure you're playing this. Yeah, well, I think some people may be reviewers who are just putting their playthrough up now that the embargo's up. I felt at the moment the boat docked. That's the fade going right to your bones. I'm just looking around. Oh, there's nothing around here. Okay. The Anderfells. The place we've heard about for so long. Oh, shit. Okay, so make sure you don't get spoiled for stuff. Yeah, no. Hush. Here, the blight on this island must be running wild. Then we'll just have to deal with it. Oh, good. There's a healing pot. So, how well do you know the Viper? Because I've heard things. Oh, what things? Like, no one really knows who he is. Is that right? That maybe oh. he used to be a slave and now fights slavers? Oh my god, the Viper's Fenris? I'm just screaming. Yes, we get a griffin eventually. Distance. 
Homest is left. Well, that's done. Well, anyway, like no one really knows who he is. Is that right? Oh, you throw explosives. Oh, they're still following us. Or not. Alright, well, fuck it. Let's go. Still standing. Not bad. Oh, we went way over where we're not supposed to. We finally get to see the Anderfells. And I didn't forget about the giveaway. We're just going to do that later in the stream. Combat? What combat? Oh shit, this wasn't even... <gasps> yes! Warden Zevka and Antoine answered our letter. They're willing to talk. In the middle of nowhere? We're the first warden... Good, we're about to get Davern. Although, I heard the voice actor may be a bit of a transphobe, which really sucks. Your distraction worked. Could have said it when we were farther away. Bizarre. I didn't say it was a good plan. Ah, you made it. Antoine, Evka. I've seen it on Twitter. I haven't yes. seen any proof because, as we know, day. Twitter. It's good to see you again. I hear you've been causing problems. I'm trying to stop them. It's not my fault the first warden has a stick up his- And you wonder why he doesn't like you. He barely likes us. What's going on? 
It's the elven gods. They're real, and they're changing the blight. Darkspawn, too. You must have heard of Demeter's Crossing. The blight there was unlike anything I've seen, and it hit too fast. Whatever comes next, it's bad. A change? Manipulation could explain it. We've been looking into oddities with the blight ourselves, and... It's altered. I can feel it. Then you believe me. You're a lot of things, Rook, and a good warden's one of them. You wouldn't lie about this. I lie about a lot of other things, but... Thanks. You're the best. <laughs> You've got our help. No need to suck up. I'll take the compliment. Wow. So what now? If the Blight's changed, we need our order. The First Warden likes us more than you, but that's not saying much. If he thinks what happened to that village was an aberration, a further hunch from Evka and myself won't win him over. We need more proof. If the Darkspawn are changing, Davern might help. Mm. Even among Wardens, he's known as a monster hunter. He got pulled on a mission, not sure what, but it's farther into the mountains. We can get you a rough location. I married someone with good advice. You find Davrin, and we'll keep after the blight. Yeah. Like I said, I've only seen it on Twitter. And as we know, Twitter's a cesspool. Got it. Stay safe. You too. We'll see you soon. Well, I'd say we found the camp. So did some darkspawn, looks like. The fire's still going. Were they ambushed? I have no idea. I have no idea who voiced Javik. Javik was not one of my favorite companions. Easy. He's not sure what you are. Neither am I. Don't you know I'm a warden? Evka and Antoine sent us. We're looking for Davrin. You found him. Mind Thank telling you why you smell like Darkspawn? Griffins hunt Darkspawn. Uh, I'm a warden? Don't you know that? Easy. I'm a warden too. We found Blight on the tent. You that company. Where are Lancet and Remy? The camp was empty when we got here. You know they, they're selling us stuff to the To the trees. We can help. Another warden couldn't hurt. Try to keep up. They announced that before the game even came out, and I was like, sold. He's got a scent. Follow the squawks. Since when do we have a griffin? Aren't they extinct? They're keeping it quiet, even from other wardens. It's why we're training in the middle of nowhere. Hassan, don't get too far ahead. He spotted something. Oh, I was going to tell you that. I'm telling everyone. Dead Darkspawn. These are part of the training. Hassan was half right. There's no time for half wrong. Hassan, we're looking for live Darkspawn. He understands. Not sure he understands anything but dinner. Keep on it, Hassan. They're around here somewhere. Leave that baby alone. Oh no, I'm telling everyone about the plush Hassan. 
Because we all need to know about Plush Hassan. Hey, Karis. Yes, Selena. Thank you for using your prime. Uh, Arkady, how far have you gotten into the game? How do we get up that? The Griffins have been training for this sort of thing. Let's see if Hassan was paying attention. Hassan, hit that! <gasps> oh shit. That's impressive. You teach him that? No. Lancet and Remy did. They're the Griffin Whisperers. So you're the bodyguard. Griffins are the warden's greatest legacy. Hold up. Whoop. I hate fighting dark bonds. Something in me just recoils from them. That's why it's a job for professionals. <laughs> Ah, okay. Uh, then I may be ahead of you depending on the order I'm doing stuff. Not have the intended effect. Rude. Remy, where are you? No, we just met you. Remy, where are you hurt? Oh, everywhere. A monster came out of nowhere. Darkspawn were following it. Ah. Uh, Once it ran ahead. It's back? Davrin, remember. A light touch. Asan's still learning. You're the trainer. Not anymore. <laughs> wow, dying cough. We have to keep going. Let's get through here. Those two statues are the spare key. Line up the symbols. What did you mean by it's back? Something's stalking Grey Wardens. We call it the Gloom Howler. I'm hunting it. Started happening seven, eight months ago. Darkspawn obey it. There's some kind of hold over them. The old Grey Warden symbol. These fucking statue puzzles, though. I'm surprised you didn't... Let's put it this way. Not a cameo that you or I would screech about, but a cameo nonetheless that no made me yell. This is real. Son, is that Elvin? It's Elvin for Arrow. Elby grows into it. More dogs born here. Lance, it's trying to stop the glue. Neither have I. It's going after the other Griffins. There are other Griffins. I feel like when Tosh shows up, I'm gonna try to climb them like a tree. The bridge is out. This place is falling apart. There's a ladder up there. That's our way through this. Good job. Apparently there's no poly though, which does make me a little sad. Make this quick. We have to get through here. Son can help us fight. Death from above. Rude? Watch out, one more to go. Big one. I see it.
Rude. Harding, you are in the way. Oh god, there's help there. What? what? That? Uh, it's coming from the area. There's an elevator we can use to get up there. Never seen Dark Spawn this bold. Unless there's a blight. There's a blight. Would explain the weird things I'm hearing. But the first warden hasn't said anything. He doesn't want to listen. He's a stubborn one. Why does the Gloomhaller want the Griffins? The real question's how it knows about them. Up until now, it only went after Wardens. Now it shows up here with a rabble of Darkspawn? These Griffins are a secret. I'm glad you have good upper body strength uh, doing this. Oh shit! Oh shit, there's two of them. Jesus. That is not the way I want to shoot my arrows. Normal. I'm not a masochist, at least not in video games. Absolute fuck. Exploding dark spawn? What is this? Like I said, this blight's different. Everything's wrong. I can hear the other griffins. Let's get in there. How do we let them out? More griffins. We have to get them out of there. Can't. Some kind of blood magic on these locks. It's okay, Hydus. Calm down. 
You too, Rumtail. We'll come back for both of you. Hey, Zero. Sure that was oh Jesus Christ I zero I'll say hi in a minute Jesus Christ. I did not sign up to play Dark Souls today. Wow, I am missing every shot. Okay, Root. Bless a health pot. Oh, Could you not? Oh no, not you calling your friends.
<sighs> Yellow, you want? You're not taking these griffins. Oh, now my special comes up. Ooh, blight killer. Yes, please. Everything was clenched. They're up there. What in the hell? The blood is mine. So it can talk. I'll spill mine before that happens. And I'll collect, Warden. On both of you. Yeah? Let's give it a go. Your time will come. Oh, shut up and start fighting. I'm sorry, what? Miss Miss Scusey, what? There are only thirteen griffins alive in Thetis. That monster just took twelve of them. What if we could help get them back? I'd ask, what's the catch? I need a monster hunter. For the blight to end all blights. The first warden agreed to this? I don't need permission to save the world. Pretty sure your oath to the warden says otherwise. Oh my god, shut what up! What an oath if we're all dead? <laughs> you got nerve. I'll give you that. Well... You did save Asan back there, so you're no lightweight. And if you can help get the other Griffins back. Oh. He likes the idea. He's hoping you brought food. All right. Come on, Asan. Let's get to know our new friends. I'm so pissed off. I was ready to throw down. Hey, GT, how are you? Here I am, ready to go fight everybody. So this is where you live, huh? In the Fade? Yeah, it's cozy. And the gods can't find us here. Right. Never going to get used to that. We'll find you in a sauna, nice. <laughs> What's wrong? Everything's wrong. Treviso and Minrathis are both under attack. Oh shit. Blighted dragons. Two of them. One for each city. Damn it. So the dragon at Demeter's crossing wasn't the only one. You got back just in time. Thank you. So this is a decision that we could not talk about during the after the preview event. You have to choose, like in Origins. Alright, what do we know? Two dragons at once has to be the gods behind it. Treviso's a merchant city. It has no defenses, and the canals run everywhere. If we don't stop that dragon, people will die. Innocent people. Alright. My people. 
They either die right away from the dragon. Sorry you hated it. That has nothing to do with me. We need to go to Treviso. And leave Minroth is to burn? Nev. The Shadow Dragons will fight right to the end of it. But we're the only ones keeping the Venatori in check. And if we fail, the Venatori will take advantage. They'll make a push for the throne. And hand the gods the entire Tevinta Empire. All right, bye, Selena. Thanks for hanging out. Is there any chance we can? Are you streaming today, Selena? Or no now? Time. I need to go home. I need to be in Minrathus. And I must go to Treviso. Go where you feel you must, Rook. We cannot wait. What's our move, Rook? Oh God. So this was one of the things we couldn't even record. Menrathus has mages, though. But I know it'll cause a decline. With our relationship with Nev. But Treviso is a merchant city with no army and just the crows. This was the part we weren't even allowed to record. Thanks, Karjan. But I mean, when we were at the event, Selena, we couldn't even record this and we could not talk about it. We couldn't hint at it. Uh, we help Lucanus and Shay. We have to trust that the Shadow Dragons can take care of things in Monrathus. That said, oh, yeah. two of you should join Nev there. See if you can help. And we'll head to Treviso. Understood. Let's all try to make it through this alive, all right? Here we go. Right, Sleazy? Vermeyer. So I chose to do this at the event. Listen, oh, yeah. The dragon, the Antan brought it here somehow. They're fighting cross and saying the dragon will break our meaningless resistance. It's worse than I thought. How do we fight this? Let's find your Please. Someone has to stop it. Ugh. Oh shit, what happened? to go again oh my god move that's a win god damn it I guess we gotta fight them got company I can use 
Fuck are you, Lucanus? We have to kill that dragon. Treviso can't take much more. Look, over here. It's Taya from the crows. Rook, you're just in time. Where the dragon attacks, the Antam soon follow. It is strong and fast. You must get its attention, then lure it onto the ground. We'll figure out a way. Drop your courage. We will need it. Oh. <laughs> this dragon fight was no fucking Just joke. Stop. This was a whole lot, just so you all know. That was a close one. You fought it off. If Gilanane hadn't called it away... It'll be back. Next time, it dies. That thing was tough. It'll be hard to put down for good. What happened to Treviso would have been worse if you hadn't <sighs> arrived when you did. I cannot imagine how much worse. Still have to help with that dragon in Minrathus. Let's go.
Oh shit. here what's the situation look around i don't know where to start treviso's all right lucanus we stopped the worst of it even if we couldn't kill the dragon the venatori had a clear shot at the palace while we faced a dragon we could barely hurt the viper drew it away from a safe house and took a claw to the gut as thanks a healer could fix the wound, but the blight's already in him. Rook's a great warden, isn't she? Do something. Or are you only good for bringing bad news? Wow. I'm not going to the wardens. I need to be here. In Minrathus. You are going to die. Ever the pessimist. I'll talk to the wardens. Antoine and Evka, they'll know what to do. I said no. I know of magic that may slow the corruption. That'll give me some time. This is all you. The risen gods, the blight, the dragon. Now the city's lost to the Venatori. Rook isn't to blame. It is what it is. Uh, tension's a little high. You should go for now. I need to be here a while. See to things. Well, shit. Dragons, Darkspawn obeying the Venatori? Maybe Solus will know something. Woody? Woody, though? I'm fine with it. I don't have particularly strong feelings about that, so... Because here's the thing. As a developer, oh, sometimes you have to make decisions you don't want to, or what works best is what works best.
Oh shit. Huh, I wonder why that is X'd out. So how's everyone doing? Uh, I'm still sniffling, I hate it. When last we spoke, you were hunting for followers of Elganan and Gilane in hopes of finding specifics. Has your search been successful? You could say that. It looks like both the Venatori and the Antom are working for Elganan and Gilane. Unsurprising. The Venatori want magical secrets, and the Antom want to destroy anyone opposing their brutal expansion. Both will readily bow to anyone who promises them power. I need something to eat, but I don't know what I want to do. And they're using that power to hurt a lot of people. The Antarm and the Venatori both have dragons doing their bidding. Dragons? That is worse than I had feared. Yeah. We drove off the one the Antarm brought to Treviso. Barely. Have you determined how the dragons are being directed? If it is blood magic, it may be possible to disrupt their control. The dragons were blighted. We think that's what let the gods control them. The blight? Of course. The Blight seems to be the gods' favored tool right now. We ran into Venatori who could control Darkspawn. Elganan would not bestow such power unless the Darkspawn were to serve as the main force of his army. And I suspect Gilanane will see the Darkspawn as new subjects for her... modifications. We've already run into a few Darkspawn nobody has seen before. That's in addition to the Blighted Dragons. That is the fate Elganan and Gilanane planned for this world then. Corruption and blighted slavery. That's rich, coming from the guy who wanted to drown the world in demons. Do you truly believe my goal was to destroy this world? Yes. I believe your goal, like you said, was to transfer the gods to a better prison. The one you're stuck in now. And you were willing to tear down the veil and destroy this world while you did so. The Veil is a wound I cut into the Fade in a moment of desperation. While making their prison, it should not exist. I had a host of spirits ready to help when the Veil fell. They would have minimized the loss of life.
Do you have any idea what you sound like? You could have actually saved the world from the Blight, but instead, you chose to kill thousands of people with your vanity project. It is not vanity. I broke this world. I am the only one who can fix it. Spoken like a god. I am not a god. I am as I have always been. A man. All too aware of his failings. But equally aware that if he did not act, accepting the judgment it would bring, all would be lost. They call me the Dread Wolf. What will they call you when this is over? I've got enough problems right now as it is. That's one for future Brook to deal with. Pragmatism. You will focus on the present, knowing that someday you will face the consequences of your choices. I believe I can work with that. If the gods are using dragons, you will wish to find someone trained to fight them. Have you unlocked the Lighthouse Alluvian? Yes, we found the crossroads. It's still confusing, though. I cannot help you from in here. You may need to find an expert in the magic of the Fade. And if the Darkspawn are to be Elganon's army, you will need Grey Wardens to fight them. I've got a few of them, and I'm a Warden myself. Maybe that's enough? Doubtful. You'll want an army. And I believe you will find a way to obtain one. You seem to have a knack for gaining the cooperation of your adversaries. Oh, rude. So this elven god thinks we need a dragon hunter and a faith expert. He's right, about the dragon hunter at least. The shadow dragons did all they could. The dragon was just too much. The moment the dust settled, the Venatori rushed in. Guess they knew it was coming. Nev's staying for now. She said she'll be back soon. But at least you took care of yours. We hurt it, but didn't kill it. The dragon flew off before we could put it down. Televiso could have used the dragon hunter. That much is true. Don't remind me. Fewer people injured, and we wouldn't have to worry about it coming back. Oh, we should not forget the second dragon in Minrathos. We ought to see what we can do to help. However, there is no telling how long Nev will be helping the Shadow Dragons with the aftermath. Hey, let's not get stuck in our regrets, all right? Hang on a minute. Not only have you retained the services of a demon assassin, you're also taking advice from the elven god who attempted to tear down the veil. Spite is my problem. That's what they always say. Rook, Lucanus is one thing, but do you really trust this Solus? Of course I don't trust him. He's the only option we have. If it makes you feel better, we've checked every piece of information he gave us. That does make me feel better. So, a Fade expert and a dragon hunter. I'll ask around about dragon hunters and see what turns up. Come talk to me in a bit. And I've been corresponding with someone about the lighthouse's reverberative oscillations and the resulting dimensional peculiarities. Oh, sorry. Not relevant. I'll get a message through to a Fade expert immediately. <laughs> see, Rook? Nothing to worry about. All right. We all know what to do. Let's get going. So how's everyone doing? Oh, now you can improve improve my equipment. Thanks. So I put the word out for dragon hunters, and I've heard back about someone who might work. It's a woman named Tosh from a group of Ravani treasure hunters called the Lords of Fortune. Sounds promising. An agent for the Lords said that Tosh is working on a mission for them along the Ravani uh -huh. coast. If we help her, she'll be free to join us and fight any blighted dragons the gods throw our way. 
What do you know about what's going on in Ravine right now? Not much more than you do. Varric and I never went there while hunting Solus. The Kunari were on pretty good terms with Ravain, but that was before the Antom military broke away from the rest of the Kuhn. I wouldn't be surprised if the Antom invaded Ravain like they did Treviso and Eastern Tevinter. All right. Guess we'll be ready. I hope someone can. We don't want to fight another dragon without help. Time to find out if the crossroads can get us to an alluvian in that area. We'll head out whenever you're ready. Oh. But hold on, we have a son now. We have to pet the goodest griffin. But also talk to Nev. Strength earns mastery. What? You're hungry? I found a yam in the kitchen. <coughs> Stubborn just means you'll starve. Trouble settling in? Doing the best I can. My job was to keep the griffins safe, not fix their dinner. I meant to son. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I guess we're both adjusting. How did Weishaupt find a son and the others? I only got involved in this a little while ago. Most wardens are still in the dark. The way I heard it, someone found a journal a few years back that mentioned a secret clutch of eggs. They've been <sighs> hidden for centuries, protected by a ward. Started hatching and out came 13 talkative griffins. Now, down to just one. I've always wondered about our history with griffins. Their emblem is everywhere. I could swear Hassan knows it too. Gives him a big head. Back in the day, Grey Wardens raised them as aerial cavalry. When a blight got going, Wardens rode them into battle. Eventually, war took its toll. They died out. Well, a confused griffin should fit right in around here. Appreciate it. There's no training manual for them anymore. I guess we'll figure it out together. Griffins don't trust easily. Lancet and Remy had to work to win them over. They said a warden and a griffin have to move as one. Think as one. They call it Turlum. Sort of unity. But now, they're both dead. Why'd the Gloom Howler attack the Airy? I intend to find out. First it stalks wardens. Now it's after the griffins. <laughs> Doesn't seem right that they'd go extinct twice. Not if I have anything to say about it. You sure you'll have time to help? You've got a lot on your plate. Elgernon and Gilanane. Hard to believe. Our very own elven gods are ending the world. That'll endear us to the rest of Thetis. But I have to say, killing a monster is one thing. Taking down the goddess of all monsters and the god of vengeance while you're at it? Oh, 
I'm not blind. Keeps me awake at night. Just making sure you know what you're in for. We're all in for it. Well, I've been in a staring contest with death most of my life. <sighs> Haven't blinked yet. <coughs> what? I told you. It's yams or nothing. <coughs> oh. Or maybe you need a new menu. This is too much open air for me. I would roll out of bed and die. Okay, Ballara, what's your lead on getting us a fade expert for the team? Good evening. Greetings. Rook, so we need a fade expert. I've been writing to a senior mage who fits the part. But right now he's on an expedition, so I reached out to his colleagues to find him. This is Lady Myrna and Vorgot. They're necromancers. Mornwatch ones, I mean. Your friend's request for a fade expert was urgent. How darksome are things outside Navarra? Very. I see. Bellara's correspondent is Professor Emric Volkarin, a fade expert and powerful psychogoth. You will need him. Where can I find him? The Professor is currently delving the shrouded halls in the Grand Necropolis. We will grant you passage to look for him. Where the dead. Lately they grow. Restless. Oh dear. Well, well, time to go get. Time to go get Emric. Oh, wait. Interesting that to there, Rook. Lacanus is with me. journal about seeing Venatorian crow meeting spots. Oh, exciting. Let's dig around some more. You ever talk to Jacob? Keep a grip. An underwater prison? That's still pretty amazing. Amazing? I suppose it is. Do you think the elves made it? It didn't seem to have entered. I think so. I wonder what it was built for. Originally, I mean. Whatever it was meant for, it's a bit of misery now. Right.
All right, we're going to do this. I'm going to take a quick break because I've not had a break since I started and I've been on two and a half hours. So... Hang out for a couple minutes. I'm going to get a bio and some water. So hang out.
Hello, hello. I took a little bit because I needed to warm up a snack. Thank you. I remembered. Come on, Ilario will meet us at Cafe Pietra. It's not that far from here. I bought. We have time before he arrives. I wouldn't mind looking around a while. Um, pre-cooked, pre-shelled, boiled eggs as a snack. I was like, that's quick. <laughs> no, Jory. No. No, I I bought some <coughs> eggs as a snack. The markets are running. Good. I need to get some things while we're here. We're really getting a shopping up. Let's try here. Episode. Monster bones. Really? For Hassan. Think of it as a bribe to stop him from chewing on the alluvia. Treviso. I barely had time to look around when we returned from the ossuary. And then there was the dragon. You miss oh, just being here without the chaos. I used to think it would never change. Ah, here. A potted plant? For Harding's garden. Spearmen are supposed to calm bad dreams. It's good in desserts, too. So you and Alario are cousins? Yes, but we're more like brothers. Katarina took us both in a long time ago now. Here's the place. In a duel to the dead. Bellara mentioned the daily seafood recipe she wants to make. The demon of virus is grocery shopping for the team. Have you seen what they eat? It's a miracle you didn't all starve before you hired me. Oh, wow. When we met, it didn't seem like Elario and Katarina were close. It was hard to be close to her, even for me. And I was her favorite. There it goes, Jolly. A good selection. Fresh fruit. Nev only eats fried fish. You'd think a detective would have discovered scurvy by now. Oh! Is that everything on the list? Yes. And Ilario should be here by now. Let's wow. go before he gets himself in trouble. Wow. Lucanus. This man's straight up... Oh. She eats like Kelly. I love the opera geek. You can't buy something for everyone but yourself. Here. This. No worries. A wyvern tooth dagger? I loved wyverns as a boy. Katarina would never let me have one of these, though. Did you arrange soon? Try to use one of the words in the game, it's gonna bop you. Cafe Pietra is just ahead. That's where I'm meeting your cousin? Why not the casino? House Cantori has many talents. Making coffee is not one of them. Wow. Finally. I thought you might leave me here all by my lonesome. Please. You think I'd ever pass up Cafe Pietra's coffee? You see, Rook? My cousin is all stomach and no heart. Wow. Don't mind him. Ilario cannot appreciate anything but himself. They serve a specialty roast here. Andural's breath. 
bitter and sweet, like a kiss goodbye. You should try it. You just described my dream cup of coffee. <laughs> so, is there a reason we're not talking about Ilario's information or what? We're still being spied on. No, the last one just left. Couldn't take your coffee talk. So, you have something? The clothes I sent after Sarah. Oh, yeah. Her trail. They say she's gone to Varantium. I have a friend who's very good at finding people. Katarina was first stolen. This is crow business. We can handle it. Apparently not. Your lead is no good, cousin. You have better information? We're compromised. There's no other way Zara could even touch Katarina. You need your eyes here, in Antiva. Zara would never be foolish enough to stay. Not with you out for blood. Of course she would. If the crows protecting her are here. Oh? Rook, reason with him, would you? He's been paranoid. I am not paranoid. She came after me. She came after Katerina. She will come for you too. If it will make you feel better, I'll clean house, all right? Leave it to me. Well, that was something. He's gone. Of course he is. Ilario always caves under pressure. Your cousin only seems to hear about one word in ten. He's always been this way. He hears what he wants to hear. <sighs> this man and his coffee. Bitter and sweet, you called that blend? Like a kiss goodbye. So, what would a first kiss be? Oh? Honey and lavender cream. Sweet. Intriguing. And you? How would you describe it? Oh shit, are we about to start a romance by mistake? Do I want to romance Lacanus though? But what about Tosh? Ooh, ah, ah. I can't save. First kisses? Ah. It's been a while. I don't think I've had you many. Need a refresher. <laughs> I see. You lead an adventurous life. No more than you, I'm guessing. I've always thought that to live truly is to live fully. But even before I was captured, my life was not really my own. So much had been determined for me. <sighs> Well, you're going for the crow, right? You must have found time for a little trouble along the way. And if you didn't, I can find you some now. We'll see. You don't know how much trouble I can handle yet. How's oh. your coffee? Dark, complex, and intriguing. Well, now. Did you head back to the lighthouse? Almost. This man and his coffee. I take it that's who you're going to go for, Zero. Since he's a man of refined taste. And coffee. Um, not sure yet, Jolly. I've not gotten two of the companions. I have those quests unlocked, but I haven't done them yet.
I was about to go get Emmerich. And then I noticed I still had this mission in, in Tiva. Oh, is that one not for me? I'm not yet sure how I feel about Ballara. I like her, but she's coming across as very manic pixie dream girl for a bit. This is it, but no sign of the professor. He's here, and that he doesn't mind us disturbing him. He is a senior necromancer. I, I don't. Oh, oh. Oh, there he is. Excuse me. I thought we were about to get pickaxed. Visitors, what a marvelous surprise. Any trouble with the lift? Our last guests were stuck for hours, poor souls. Oh. <sighs> Professor Emmerich Volkaren of the Morn Watch. Hello, Professor. Uh, we've never met, well, in person, but I I I've been writing to you. Bellara, my dear girl. What a pleasure. Surely you didn't come all this way just to see me. Um, actually, we did. You see, we need a Fade expert. <clears throat> I'm Rook. Charmed. Wow, that's so rude. Are you dead or not? I didn't expect such a warm welcome considering please don't be put off the workforce is perfectly harmless 
I'd be pleased to continue our conversation after I tend to some small business here. Oh, okay. I must it's... investigate. Would you two mind accompanying me further into the shrouded halls? Sure. Screaming? Something's gone awry in this part of the necropolis, Rook. The dead stir more easily than they should. Sure, I'll help you as soon as I pick up everything. What's that ahead? Strange. These halls should be under the protection of the bell. He's spry for an older fellow. What? Is that a despair demon? Fascinating, isn't it? They shouldn't be able to breach the shrouded halls at all. Take your word for it. I see we've company. Careful, Rook. It singled you out. Oh, great. What? Where did one go? Nice. It's vital we discover why that spirit manifested here. Lead the way, Professor. Oh my god, Zero. This is what I wish Dorian could have done in Inquisition. Zero, be very glad I like you. Sorry, Professor, I must pick up every shiny object I see. You know what? I'm just going to pretend I don't see the chat. I'm just going to pretend I do not perceive it. Someone's barred the door and chained the sunken star. There's undead here. We may need to defend ourselves depending on their condition. Haven't fought undead in a while. No They're reaching these. They're mindless. I thought you could control them. I'm afraid sometimes the weaker dead work themselves into frenzies. Poor things. That didn't work. I'm ready to go again. Well, that's true what I hear about Grey Warden stamina. Need some help? 
Thank you. The star, the bell, can banish these despair spirits if we unchain it. We'll need a wisp to unseal the doors leading out. Could you please find one and bring it here? Okay. How? Give your greetings and the wisp will follow. What? Hello. Ah, wisps are the simplest of spirits, but quite helpful. Bring the wisp here, and we can unseal the doors. <sighs> doors open. Where to now? This should lead us to the upper chambers, where we can free the bell. There's someone I'd like to consult with on the way. Emmerich's consultant, you say? So, Professor? Just Emmerich, please. You weren't that surprised we need a Fade Expert. The spirits talk. Even the simplest have been clamoring about chaos in the Fade. Someone coming to consult wasn't an if, so much as a when. Fired upon! One second. A win for us. I need one of those pots I saw. Oh shit, there was one right there. Hit. Ready 
Alright, enjoy dinner. Left. We're clear. Jesus. How's everyone doing? I know I keep asking, but oh, good, a health pot. Who else among us was trained by Zelda to break every pot you ever see? It's freezing. What kind of magic is this? Echoes of the despair spirits. Misery devouring itself. We should keep our distance. If provoked, these manifestations will shatter. This is locked too, and I didn't see any wisps around. Then I shall call for aid. What? They've answered. We'll need to guide the wisps who've just arrived to the door. Hmm. I'll need a wisp. Oh. Oh, for fuck's sake. Are you seriously me right now? Those wisps really came just because you asked. They Strange. This door shouldn't be here. Shouldn't it? The necropolis rearranges itself every so often. If you were gonna come with me, why did I come over here? Wisp, are you talk- wait, does the wisp- Did the wisp expire? You are kidding me. So I guess I gotta run. Here's our second wisp. Just waiting for us. <sighs> Almost polite. I assure you, good warden, not everything in the necropolis is as hostile as despair. Take your word for it. Well, lesson learned. You gotta run once you get a wisp. There's the last wisp. Good. Let's return to the door. Uh, 
Um, that last wisp didn't come with us. All right, Wisp. Well done. Past these chambers, we'll find some assistance with reaching the bell. The despair is far more pervasive than I thought. We must stop who's ever drawing these spirits here, Rook. You think a person's behind all the despair demons? Oh yes. Mortals are their prime attraction. Here they come. Uh, green water, what is it? Yeah, no. They attack from afar. Assault now. That one, quickly. For ranged attacks. Keep that up, Rook. That's been sorted. All right, where's the green pot? I know I saw one. Or not. So much death. Hi. How do get rid of all these despair demons? Their source is near the bell you saw earlier. Ringing will banish them. But we must find who lured them there in the first place. Oh.
Game said you thought. I trained with the Wardens in Neanderthals. Home to the fortress of Weishaupt. I've heard stories. You must tell me about your journeys once we're above ground. Sure. Yes, I did go back for money. So is anyone in the chat not playing this? Just not your bag or... Despair spirits. But how? You must open yourself to possibilities while in the necropolis. Would you mind lighting those braziers, Rook? Ah. This should unseal our final pass to the bell. It's best we unchain it quickly. What's this magic bell do exactly? The sunken star will drive away despair. Any malicious spirit that hears the tolling of the bell will be banished to the Fae. Ring the bell, dead demons. Got it. It also holds great significance on some of our equinoctial rituals. You already sold me. Excellent. Approach the body and we'll begin. I'm sorry, approach the what now? I wish there was a way to trip photo mode without... without having to go to the menu. Can someone do me a massive favor or just give me a to do? Let's see if there's a way to map photo mode to a single button. Also, I should probably save. I haven't saved in a while. Hey, Nolly. Thank you. Yeah, in a couple hours, I think I'll do the part, the giveaway. By seal and flame, who brought despair in our midst? <sighs> despair? Who brought it here? Venatori. The Venatori. Uh, of course. This way, please. What did you just do? The colloquial term is corpse whispering, a gift that manifested with my magic. Gift is one word for it. 
Oh, wow. I have no idea how the other watchers navigate the necropolis without it. I got that wisp by accident. Shh. I think I hear someone. This map is useless. We wasted three slaves in those traps. If that hand of glory burns down, so don't dust us. We found those Venatori. They have no place in these halls. There we go. We ah, you missed me, son of a bitch. You are commanded. At the ready. Yep. Way to get it done. You hit me so hard. Venatory after gold artifacts, raw magic. Their first envoys were obsessed with gathering power for some new masters. Ah, oh, I'll fill you in on them later. Oh. 
wall. I can't break that one. Oh, it's in there. Okay. All right, all right. Let me in. Oh boy. Let's not disturb him. Oh yes. An excellent hit, bro. Oh shit, I got extra potions. Not this despair demon coming after me. Demon. That's the last of them. I see someone by the crate. I don't think they're Venatori. Damn it, Emmerich. This looks interesting. A spirit labyrinth? I didn't know they'd learn to make miniature ones into Vinter. Anders Vessel? What? I'm sorry, what? What's this? A vessel to store the magic the Venatori intended to siphon away- You heard me! 
The item said Anders Vessel. Hold on. And as an Anderfels, maybe, but it says Anders Vessel. I like how we all just stopped. We're like, excuse me, what? That better be Anders like the fucking Anderfels. Everyone who's ever played a Dragon Age game is something like what? Hello? Did the Venatori bring you here? They said... They said I'd spilled the wine too many times. That I'd be a better sacrifice than slave. You are in Navarra, sir. There are no slaves on our soil. Please remain here. After we've seen to the rest of the Venatori, I'll send for someone to escort you above. Oh, well, all uh, right. Those Venatori dragged that man down here just to die. The Watchers will shelter him. We'll inquire if he has any family in Minrathus. As for the Venatori, what remains of them will be put to work. That better be Anders as an Anderfell. Because technically, wouldn't Anders be on his calling by now if this is ten years after Inquisition? The Sunken Star can help us if we break the Venatori's chains. Right. I feel like there's a boss, so I am not going to use my special. Whatever you're doing, you're going to stop. Headshot. your foot.
Oh, I should have done, not done that. Die. That's the last chain. We must return to the lower level to ring the bell. Emmerich, where go? Did he just jump down there? Sir. How did you? That's how, fucker. Can someone note that ban in the chat in the Discord? Cause you know what? How the fuck do you get down there? Ah. I guess there's gonna be one a day. The ritual to wake the bell will draw despair's attention. And any more venatory. I'll need you to keep them occupied while I work. There's the venatory. Fight a little longer. Careful on your left. The gods. Bless me. Venatory brought demons. Typical of them.
Take him out! You've got a rage demon. Hold fast! Oh shit! Rage Demon's got an upgrade. No worries. That was a quick hello and goodbye. Let's ensure these cultists didn't leave anything dangerous behind. I'll ask our attendants to gather their bodies later, of course. <sighs> and this is a severed hand. It can't be. A hand of glory? The Venatori should never have this. I must find out where it came from. Thanks, Let me know when you'd like to return to the chambers above. Let me take one last look around. Um. All right, well, fuck it, let's go. Shall we depart? Let's get back to the lighthouse. You can tell me why you've sought out a fade expert on the way? I want to complain about that asshole, but I also I don't want to give them to any swear we've seen the air. Elven gods hey, Steven. It would welcome in, welcome in. Disruptions. At the least. Welcome in, Raiders. What Rooks witnessed are. How are you? Ah, thank you, Manfred. No one ever brings me tea after a slog through a haunted crypt. My assistant, Manfred. Always thoughtful. You spoke of danger to the Fade. The Hello, Elven y'all. The plant a tear it wide open to get to the Blight. And they've already messed with it. Demons. No worries. Tears in reality. Our team needs a Fade expert. How was Many the game, the stream today, Stephen? But with events so dire... I'd be delighted to assist. It has been you are. many years since you left us. Well, yes, but elven gods, ancient magics. I couldn't bear miss this. Besides, I've spent my life exploring the Fade and speaking to spirits. If Rook needs an expert, none are better qualified than I. Only if your assistant's uh, coming. Manfred? Good, we just got oh, Emmerich. Well, we got one more companion to recruit. Wonderful. I'll gather my things. Come, Manfred. <gasps> oh, God, Manfred. 
Yes, I'm enjoying Valgard. at peace again. And Emmerich was off hey, to Jay. an adventure. But in Navarra, nothing stays down for long. We have had one asshole today, so I think the we Victorian hit our quota. unearthed something no one should have. And delivered it to the worst possible person. Emmerich's journey would soon bring him face to face with the gloaming lantern. <laughs> One second. But for anyone who doesn't know me, my name is Cypher, but I'm pretty sure anyone coming from Steven's stream knows because we all share a community. Uh, thank you for your resub, Jay. All right, we need to Recruit our last companion, but first let's take a walk around the crossroads. I'm also going to go fix my ears. I kind of dislike how they look. Ah, now this is unlocked for... Emmerich. A third edition of the Unnameable Elements? I didn't even know it had editions. Oh, it's much improved with the index. Uh, please, borrow it if you'd like. I'd love to. Oh, Rook, you probably wanted to say hi. Thanks, Professor. You look moved in. Just a few essentials. Manfred was a great help with the boxes. What a fascinating place this lighthouse is. What do you make of it? It's great. Big, mysterious, lots of art. Everyone's got their own room. It'd be easy to fall in love with such a place. I think Ballara has. She's been quite welcoming. However, I noticed a few of the others taken aback by Manfred. And I overheard remarks about my skulls. My necromancy won't cause any undue worry, will it? We're still getting used to one another. True. And yet... Give it time. We'll settle in. Aww. <laughs> oh. uh, please excuse me. Manfred and I should finish our inventory. Thank you for stopping by. <sighs> We must protect Manfred at all costs. By the way, Rook, before I left, Myrna and Vorgoth asked if we could assist with an outbreak of hauntings across Thetis. They also mentioned Hauntings. displaced wisps in the necropolis. What? I'm not sure what's frightened them, but it bears investigation. Hauntings and scared wisps? Let's look into it. You just got Thank here. You. We'll depart for the necropolis whenever you're ready. You just got here and you got a quest? You just got here. How do you have a quest? We just got here. That's my room. Yeah, yeah, I know, I know, I need to. Now can I upgrade? Abundance. Oh my god. Uh... Also, is Nev back yet? Oh, 
Uh, zero. I don't know if you know this, but they do sell a plush. Uh, Manfred. Did I see you writing a message to the Inquisition? What's that about? You know, Varric and I were part of the Inquisition, right? Yes. I'm trying to get news about the South. And the Asan. Carter hasn't replied to any of my messages. I'm trying not to worry about what's happening there, but... No, it's probably fine. Charter's just busy. She's always busy. Charter? Who's that? She's the Inquisition's spy master. Or she would be, if there was still an Inquisition. I suppose she just works for the Inquisitor now? I haven't heard much about the Inquisition in years. Oh, that's intentional. When the breach was open, we needed a large group to stop Southern Thetis from falling into chaos. It's changed in the years since. We're a smaller force working underground to keep an eye on things going on in the world. Why isn't she here? We could use a hand. Charter entrusted the search for Solus to Varric, to us. The world's large and she's got many things to deal with. So how long were you with the Inquisition? Ten years? Something like that. Why? You must know the Inquisitor. Oh? Well, yeah. We worked together. I wasn't part of the Inquisitor's inner circle, though. I spent more time with the ordinary people, the ones you didn't hear about. Yes, what about the advisors? And the Inquisitor's advisors? What about them? Hmm. Of all of them, what? I'd say Josephine is my favorite. She's lovely. She still sends me a box of handmade sweets from Val Royale every year on my name day. Aww. Colin and I got along too, but he was always busy. He would have bad days from lyrium withdrawal sometimes, and I would share the tea that my ma sent. Aww. He's from Ferelden too. Maybe it reminded him of home. What about Leliana? I heard she's... intense. <laughs> I think she likes to cultivate that reputation. She's not nearly as terrifying as she sounds. Oh, I passed her in the Great Hall one day, and she suddenly turned and asked me if I wanted a nug. <laughs> a nug? Those small pink rodent things? What for? <laughs> she loved them and made a hobby of breeding them as pets. So did you take the nug? No. <laughs> what am I going to do with a nug? But you did know people from the Inquisitors in a circle, didn't you? I knew them, sure. But those early days, all I wanted was to prove myself and not get in anyone's way. Some of them were more approachable than others. <laughs> Sarah was a puppy with a new toy. A hundred new toys. Fun, if you can handle the mess. She was really the only one who could make Rainier, well, Blackwall then, let down his guard. Otherwise, he kept to himself and stuck to the stables. We'd talk when I visited the horses. And there was Cole, of course. The spirit boy? Yep. I was just sitting on the walls one day, and he asked if he could join my game. Like, a card game? Nah, just good old people watching. Must have seemed like a game to him somehow. We'd pick strangers out of the crowd and try to say something about them. Like, ooh, she heard the joke yesterday and she's still trying not to laugh. Or one of Cole's. His eyes remind her of the ones beneath her bed. Who stores eyes under their bed? I'm partial to a nice wall display myself. Well, that's one interpretation that never occurred to me. Thanks. You're welcome. Wasn't Cole an empath? He must have been great at this game. Ah, but the rule was you couldn't say anything you actually knew. He got it in the end. I think. So you didn't ask him if he guessed right? Well, being right wasn't the point. Making a habit of seeing people was. I think he liked that. It's why you don't miss. So tell me about these ordinary Inquisition members I haven't heard about. The Inquisition hired hundreds, and most of them weren't Magisters or Ben Hasrith or the left hand of the Divine. 
There were scouts and stable hands, Hi, carpenters Kelly. and cooks and quartermasters, even two dedicated pastry chefs. Most of them volunteered, like me. We wanted to help in whatever small way we could. You helped people. That's not small. It sure felt like it sometimes. Oh, Harding. I'd sit with Rector and Faulkner and we'd watch the important people with their important business rushing by. The uh, Rector, Faulkner. Liliana gave all her agents pseudonyms. Right, like Charter. Well, Charter's Charter, but when the other two and I were together, we were just Lace, Wilbur, and Katya. Do you miss it? The Inquisition, I mean. It's hard to miss an organization. They're only as good as their people, don't you think? But I do miss my friends. We write each other, but it's not the same. Oh. And the Inquisition is different from what we've built here. Not better or worse, just different. It's special when you're among people working toward the same goal. Not everyone. There was Solus. What did you really think of him back then? Lonely. He always seemed lonely. So? Hard not to be when you hold yourself above everyone else. You mean it's hard not to be lonely when you're a pompous ass? <laughs> Something like that. You can say it, you know. Try it out. Solus is a pompous ass. Maybe he is, but I can still wow. feel sorry for him, can't I? Anyway, I'm sure something out there is on fire, and here I am rambling about the past. I should let you go. Talk later? They better not be trying to make me feel bad for Solus, because fuck that dude. Oh, I was actually going to my room because I wanted to change my ears, which sounds weird out loud. Poor Nev. She didn't deserve what happened to her city. None of the Shadow Dragons in Marathas did. Not that it would have been any better in Treviso. Sometimes there's just no good choice, right? Wow, way to kick me in the teeth, Bellara. <gasps> Pet the baby. Hey, Yasan. This is the stream now. Boop. Hi there, boy. Ten, ten, no notes. Oh, Lacanus has an exclamation. What does he have? Rook. Do you have a minute? Of course. Something wrong? Thea wants to meet. Well, that doesn't sound like a bad thing. She wants to plan Katerina's funeral. Ah, oh, shit. Oh, right. If you don't mind, I could use some backup. In case Spike gets out of hand. Let's not keep Thea waiting. Oh, we're going right now? All right, I guess we're going right now, damn. But first, let's fix my ears. <sighs> oh, I do find it hilarious that I said the word Anders and half the chat just suddenly popped up. Everyone 
was doing or just hold on Varric I don't know why, but the super big elf ears were absolutely bothering me. There we go. That is so much better. cauliflower ear even an option Oh, that's so much better. I know some elves, because someone was saying last night that WoW elves usually have really big ears. Was that you, Arcade? Or no? Somebody mentioned WoW elves and big ears last night, and I don't remember who it was. Hey, Harvey. How are you, Harvey? People are energized after seeing that dragon run out of Treviso. They sing the cross praises more loudly in the street. Hey, Baze. Thank you. I'm probably going to do the start to get away in maybe another hour. Good, you're here. Thank you for making the arrangements, Dea. For Caterina? How could I do otherwise? I'm so sorry, Lucanis. This must be such a blow. Rook, thank you for coming with him. I need one de la Muerte to plan this. His cousin has been no help at all. I'm sorry, Dea. This is just too much right now. Lucanus would have stayed in the base drinking coffee if I hadn't agreed to come along. Oh, I thought that was helpful. Us. I swear these boys are exactly the same. Oops. There's a lot to plan. But first, I need the ashes. Ashes? Make it help us. Yes, the ashes. Katerina's ashes. From the cremation? Oh, yes. Of course. I'll get them to you right away. Ilario, what happened? What do you mean? Katerina, how? How did the Venatori get to her? When? Where? In the estate? In the city? How did they get past our people? What did they use? Poison? Blades? I need to know. Cousin, stop. You can't dwell on this. It'll drive you mad. 
I'm not dwelling. Zara killed the first Talon. I have to know how if I'm going to stop her. I told you. I'm handling it. Are you, though? Boys, enough of this. We have other things to discuss. Uh, my apologies, Andrea. Continue without me. I'll get you the ashes. How are you holding up? I'll be fine. Better once we kill Zara Renata. It's him I'm worried about. Hilario can be a handful. <gasps> but this? The only time I've seen him like this was when Lucanis died. You're worrying, aren't you? What will people say if they hear the demon of Virantium has a big, soft heart? He's been careless at times, but never when his own life was on the line. Zara took down the first Talon. Anyone could be next. And my cousin doesn't want to think about it? You have a point. It's not like Ilario to ignore a knife coming at him. What do you need from me for the funeral? Come. I'll get us some drinks, and we can make the arrangements. Okay. Our house owes you for handling all of this. Katerina was family. Can you imagine what she'd say if she saw us all like this? She'd be furious, especially at Ilario, as usual. How did you stay on her good side? <laughs> what good side? To hear Katerina tell it? Lucanis can do no wrong. It's easy to look good standing next to my cousin. Wow. I'll have my people keep an eye on him for you. Thank you, Taya. Go on. I'll let you know if something comes up. Wow. Okay, then. The game just said your cousin's a fuck up. Seriously. They're like, so, your cousin, huh? Oh yes, error regeneration, please. We still have to go to Ravine. Probably should get Bilar in the party. Um, it sounds pseudo Spanish to me. What's funny is when Arkady and I were co-writing a, a very we long fic, I would write any Antivan in Spanish and they would write it in Italian or Latin. Oh no, that was to mean. <laughs> but I feel like in game they're using some Spanish. Hey, Jamie. The old jumpers are in trouble. They could use our help if we can find them. This map is a good start. Let's go. 
Yes, I do not speak Italian, so... I was no use there. Thank you. Spectacular rope. Nice one, Professor. Oh, I mean, Emmerich. Huh. That's fine. Oh yeah. My Spanish is probably rusty now anyway because I don't get to use it. Sure. Oh. Well, that was certainly something. Oh, you parried me. Fuck you. Dosher. Finish them off. Right up. 
All together now. Took him down clean. Ooh. What are these horrible things? Oh, bless. Sorry, I'm not super talkative. There's combat. Ew, blight. An to a wolf. Better know who that's for. This is where Tainal was headed. There's Blight here. She didn't mention that. Could be new. Blight spreads fast. So now that I'm not fighting for my life. Oh, gross. Ended up blighting Oros. Have good dinner. Those statues don't look right. They appear to be wood, not stone. I'm afraid these were once people. What happened to them? It's like they were frozen mid stride. I've been on about four hours, I think, Another actually. Statues. I'm start the giveaway and <sighs> old forest is weird. Here goes nothing. Ooh. Ooh. 
Look at that. All right, I'm gonna start the giveaway. Where is my bot? I'm gonna let it run for 45 minutes. Amanda. All right, it is a G502 aluminum mouse. I'm going to try to find a picture of it. That is the mouse you can win. It is global because because Logitech is handling the shipping. So one second. You must be here and you must be following. Oh, that's where I just was. I wish I knew of a better way to manage the giveaway because I'd like it to exclude people who just follow just for the giveaway. Ugh, oh, what a horrible way to go. My word, carnivorous plants. Perhaps we can bring one back to the lighthouse for Harding to, uh... That's a no. Everything about the forest is changing. Now even the plants can kill you. Oh, great. Oh, no.
Oh, interesting. I don't really know how to use stream elements, so... Where the fuck am I going? Where am I going? So it says destroy the blight boils, but I don't see them. be a little lost. Another owl. Wow, okay. All right, I am very lost. Oh my god, I could have gone that way. But wait, I was just here. I'm very lost. I'm like, didn't I just go this way? of aqueducts. Imagine the skill required to build all of this. Mm, so we need a thingy. What do we have here?
All right, I am lost as fuck. I see we've company. And that was death. Oh, thanks, sir. Well, can't jump down there. So, that was a no. That's fine, Dre. So you still can't swim. That's good to know, I guess. Another owl. Look at that. I mean, you couldn't swim in Inquisition either, so.
Alright, I have come back to this spot like eight times. I'm about to be like, this is the first mission where I say fuck this. Okay, I am real confused, y'all. If this is correct, this memento should be right here. Did the blight come back? fucking blight came back. This is where Taino was headed. There's blight here. She didn't mention that. Could be new. Blight spreads fast. Okay. But I didn't die, die. Wait a minute. I was here before with Harding. Oh, Rose. He didn't make it. But it seems he managed to destroy the relic. Taenor and Gus must be out here somewhere. We'll keep looking. Okay, that wasn't a memento. Okay, so now that is destroyed. But I didn't like die die. Dark spawn. Wait. I think that's Tino. No! Tino!
Hey, man. You know what? I'm gonna leave this alone for now. And I'm gonna go back to the lighthouse or I'm gonna go do something else. I wanted the map, that's what I wanted. Damn, Nev's still gone? Hey, Allie, how are you? Thank you. I'm okay, I'm tired. Um, Ellie, I am doing a giveaway though, and chat um, is G502AL if you want to enter for a limited edition aluminum mouse. It is global. Uh, exclamation, sorry. G502AL. Hey. There you go. Hi, I'm Brooke. I'm very much hoping you're Tosh. Yeah. Nice to meet you. The Lords want to hit a cave on the coastal cliffs. Big Vincimer makes her lair there. We get her out, the Lords get in, we go home and get drunk. Might be more on Tom. <laughs> Don't get in my way. I've got a good feeling about her. Oh, Ellie, all of the names are in the band word list so people so can't come in and exactly? spoil. We need to lure the Vincimer out of her lair. I set bait. She comes out to eat. My partners loot the lair while she's out here. We'll find the bait on the beach. You said the dragon we're dealing with was a Vincima. Yeah. Blue with a yellow belly. Breathes lightning. Light? Now we're talking. We're not fighting her. Lords just want the horde in her lair. On Tom ahead. Be ready. They go hard. Right, I'm like, I might have to climb Tosh like a tree.
Yikes! Shit! This is not your land. Rude. Ah, you miss me, fucker. I caught my breath. Rogue, a little busy right now. Got no problem fighting other Kunari. I'm from Ravain. Not like I follow the Kune. You've got the arm ropes. Sure. I wear a lot of stuff. You don't get to tell me who I am. Doesn't matter anyway. The Antom don't follow the Kune either. Not anymore. Well, okay then. Gosh, why do you want to work with us? I don't. Uh, uh, I thought you wanted us here to help you. No. Oh. Okay, then. Um. The. What? Ellie, you know I'm taking notes for work, right? We're not fighting the dragon? No. Vinsomers eat big game, usually sea life. They're not hostile unless you do something stupid. Like poke around in its lair? Right. So we lure her out, then the lords go in and grab anything shiny. But you do kill dragons, right? You're a dragon hunter. I kill them when they need killing. This one doesn't. All right, beach is up ahead. Right. You said we'd find bait here. They don't find us. Come on. I'm s Look out! Deep stalkers! Knew they'd find us. The deep stalkers are the bait? Yup. Now you're stealing my chips. I mean, that's a you problem. Oof. 
I'm back, thank you. Are you following me? That's the last of them. Now what? Uh, now I get the fire going and make our dragon dinner. Good. She'll like it. And this potion will put her to sleep for a few hours. But we gotta get her attention. Use the horn up there. Come on, she'll be here soon. So, we held up our end of the bargain. You did okay. Wow. So Tasha's gonna oh, be one of those... Right now, we're trying to take down evil god monsters and their blighted dragons. What? That can't be right. Dragons don't get blighted. They're smart enough to avoid that crap. However it's happening, the gods are using the blight to force dragons to attack people. That's messed up. Somebody needs to stop them. Bless. There you go. A task hurry. Where are we headed? That old Grey Warden fort. Anton might be there. I want to see what they're doing. If it's anything the Lords of Fortune need to worry about. She responded quickly to the horn. This time. You fed her before? Took a while to get her used to it. Sounds like you've got her trained. You train a dog. You reach an understanding with a dragon.
Vinsomers are clumsy on land. Better in the water. They cut the surface like a knife. They swim? They dive down after prey like a giant bird. Sometimes they stun schools of fish with their lightning. Alright, be safe, Kelly. In a single bite. Hey chat, what should I order for late lunch, early dinner? Tacos are a little messy, so if I order tacos, I need to stop playing. So I can't really eat tacos and play. That was close, but bigger than a griffin. Letting us know she sees us. Might also be her way of saying thanks for the food. Some of these buildings look like Grey Warden architecture. Good eye. Wardens used to have a big outpost here. They left after a volcano erupted. Said it closed some tunnels. Makes Pizza sense. could work. The volcano floods the deep roads with magma. You need to worry about Darkspawn using those tunnels. Pizza probably could work. The Antom are definitely here. Let's check inside the fort. I want to see what they're doing. Hey, Taru. How are you? Oh, there's a bunch of explosives. More on Tom. You're not even supposed to be here. Oh no! Juicy sounding. Weak dust people? I'll show you weak dust people. So the Antom took over the outpost after the Great War. Oh, yeah. Ravane and the Canari were at peace forever. Then the Antom broke away from the Kune and invaded. The Kunari builders are part of a different cast. They didn't break away. So the Antom take over old forts like this instead of building their own.
Oh, Ellie, are you gonna stream for Extra Life at all this weekend? I am playing a rogue, yes. Grapples, nets, the Autom are going after the Vincimer. She's a dragon. She can take care of herself. Not after I drugged her. Come on. They've been watching. They knew I drug her to make her sleep. Assholes! Nice. Ah, shit. Thanks, Tosh. Oh, shit. I brought her down. She's mine by right. <laughs> Makara. Mara Namra Benari Ebala. A Tosh Martarost. A Sitarala. Kyuto. Kyuna Sipishidam. Oh shit! Tarala. Okay. That was definitive. Ah, uh, there's just two and a half minutes left in the giveaway. By the way. Jesus. You have two minutes left if you want to get in on this giveaway. I need y'all to stop that. Obviously, I am not going to be talking much during this fight. This is like fighting the air shock. What the fuck? Shut up. Good to go. Watch the 
Shut up. Oh god. So <sighs> you breathed fire. Yeah. You oh, don't just shit. hunt dragons. You're part dragon? Were we supposed to know this? Because I don't remember you mentioning it. We can talk later. Let me know when you're ready. I'll burn the chains off the dragon. A trapped animal is a scared animal. She'll be angry once we free her. You're right. We gotta be ready to run. Hopefully she won't chase us. Holy shit. Oh, let me pull the winner. Alright, drum roll in chat, please. Kelly, you won! Well, I know how to get a hold of Kelly. Let me. Kelly's driving, so I do know how to get a hold of her. And I know her address already, so. Hopefully she will. All right. Thanks, y'all. The other thing I'm doing is if I hit 500 sub points, I'm going to give away Rook's Coffer.
Uh, I have an extra one because Bioware sent me one. But only if I had 500 sub points. And we're still at least 200 away. As one dragon flew off, now safe to finish its nap, uninterrupted, another was about to wake up. The surviving Antam poachers carried news of a fire-breathing Kunari back to their leader. Tosh and the team would soon find themselves being hunted by the Dragon King. Oh, that doesn't sound good. Wonderfully done, Tosh. While you <gasps> Isabella! The fiery dragon, we looted the shiny stuff from her cave. So, Rook, Varric's talked about you. I see he wasn't making shit up this time. They call me Isabella, among other things. What did you find in the cave? A lot of dragon shit, gold, some fancy trinkets, and this. <sighs> Alright, if we have gone all the way back to the first fucking Dragon Age game and got Isabella, we better see Fenris at some point. And if you know, don't fucking tell me. Or I will ban you. Someone came into Brian's chat and tried to spoil a companion cameo. Well, a, com a cameo. Not only were they lying, we saw that person literally later. All right, bye, y'all. All hmm. Which means Did someone spoiled this them? on Twitter. Do I didn't realize who Shit, it was. It conveys knowledge. While not as impressive as a magical explosion, it can still change the world. Rook, this is Shathan. She's our expert on Canari artifacts. This piece predates the Steel Age by centuries. It comes from an earlier attempt at settlement. One that left no survivors. That pisses me off. That means someone spoiled you it. I just didn't know who I was looking at. Fire. What? No. Were you seen by the Antan? Yes. You promised you would be careful, Evatosh. You need to be away for a while. It is good you are joining Rook's team. I'm what? Oh, people aren't using spoiler tags. Wait, were you not aware of this? Our contact here said you'd agreed to join us. Didn't Shathan? I thought you and your mother had agreed on this. Hey, Bagara. No. Whoops. Well, you'll work it out. You always do. For gold and glory, Tash. You're welcome back whenever. Rook. Pleasure doing business with you. A Mother, whole year. What did you do? I thought you would enjoy the chance to work with Rook's team. Do you not wish to stop these blighted dragons? Of course I do. I might have decided to join on my own. Maybe after you talk to me. Oh. I talked to you about not using your fire in front of the Antan. Is she gonna cry? I will prepare potions for you to take. Would you prefer ginger or lavender? <sighs> the ginger. Hassam Finek. Rook, you will keep her safe. I'm sorry, she's like a foot taller than me. All right. 
We just got... We just got our last companion. Well, it must be nice to have your mother so involved in your life. <laughs> anyway, welcome to the team. Might not be what you wanted, but we could really use the help. Uh, six. Hey. It is. Sorry? Joining your team. It is what I wanted. Glad to hear it. Uh, six. I just got the last one. Right. The uh. hate magic. They always talk about how much better Kunari are than everyone else. Now they worship elven gods for power? Hypocrites. But it explains why they pushed so hard into Ravain. With this, Demetta's crossing and the Blighted Dragons, and everything else we're all dealing with, feels like we're at war. A lot of little wars. They want a war? We'll damn well give them one. You need an army to fight a war, though. They've got two. The Venatori and Antom wasted no time allying themselves with the gods. Power at any cost. So how do we fight back, then? We don't have an army, but we do have allies. All right, bye, Mackenzie. After Demeter's crossing, it's personal for them. Varric, put on the shoes, crew, particularly please. Help save their city. Thea and Viago know what is owed. They will make good on that debt. Also, Lady Morrigan requested a meeting at the Cobbled Swan in Minrathis. Could she have found some trace of the gods? Probably. Morrigan doesn't visit crowded taverns for fun. I also heard from Grey Wardens out in the Hosburg wetlands. Antoine and Evka. Something strange is happening with the Blight there. I bet it involves the gods. Any details on the Blight in the wetlands? No. But you know how Antoine's normally got nice, neat handwriting? Yes. Could barely read his note. He's either excited, scared, or both. The First Warden hasn't been thrilled with how I'm carrying out my duties. So are you a new one, huh? If we go to the wetlands, I'm hoping the First Warden's safely over in Weishaupt. Couldn't say. Still, you can't get in any more trouble with the Order than you already are. Yeah. Gillenain has laid low since we hurt her dragon. But the blight spreads rot wherever the gods go. And no one's better at tracking blight than wardens. <sighs> Morrigan and those wardens feel like our best leads on finding the gods. Are they really gods? Or just ancient mages? It's not clear. They're gods. Or the closest to oh, hey. them. Nev. You're back. Yeah, I am. Good to have you back. This is Professor Emmerich Volkarin, our Fade expert, and Tarsh, our dragon hunter. They joined while you were away. Hey. Charmed. Right. Not everyone has met. So you're a dragon hunter? Mirathus could have used you. What's going on? Back home. What isn't? Look. You made an impossible call without enough information. I get it. It's the corner the gods put us in. It just might take time to shake off. You are back, though, right? Yeah, Val. I'm back. Good to have you back, whatever the circumstances. Everyone needs to be part of this. That's the only way we'll win. After what happened to Minrathus, I've got even more reason to go after the gods. If anyone's got a shot at this, it's the people here. I'm still on the job. Count on it. Great. Let's follow up on some leads. I'll let Lady Morrigan know we're ready to meet. I'll send word to Antoine and Evka. They're holed up in a town called Lavendel. Everyone else should rest up. Be ready to move when I call.
Varric, please put on shoes. Easy, is it, kid? What do you mean? Making the big choices, then living with the consequences. Feels like stopping two gods isn't the kind of thing that should get handed to a fresh leader. Though, someone needs to be in charge, right? Oh, Bakaro, all Everyone the companions are in the band word list to keep people from spoiling. I have to be ready to give them, even when I'm not certain. And that's why I recruited you, Rook. I knew you could fill my shoes. Anyway, you've got a meeting with Morrigan to attend, and dealing with whatever the Wardens found. Can I take Almost a nap? Chatting is taking it out of me. Think I'll rest for a bit. Good work, Rook. You'll find your way through this. I know it. Okay, but Varric's the only one to walk around barefoot in this fucking fortress that we don't know about. Like, we don't know if this place is clean. I don't know who cleans in here. Oh. Oh. I guess it would be the same with Lacanus. But can I go talk to people first? The spirits lament, Dweller. The blight spreads here. Seek its roots. I still can't do anything. Oh, we can go to Hosberg now. What's the level cap? Does anyone know? Oh, damn. Things because I honestly didn't know. I 
I can find them. It's interesting there's nothing in Minrathus now. I find it interesting that Nev no longer will help you. That's an interesting mechanic. What? This can't? Oh, no. What? Where is everyone? What did the Venatori do to the Shadow Dragons? No! Oh, God. Are you gonna be okay, Taru? Uh, I've never written about Fallout Shelter, so you have me confused with someone else. certainly didn't invite them in. Gotta be a trail or something around. So you have me confused with someone else. I have never written about Fallout Shelter. Spoiler. All black people in academia and games are not the same. It shouldn't have my... It shouldn't have me on there. Uh, I'm not Samantha Blackman. That's not your mama gamer. I don't think I ever did a guest post on there either, so... So, yeah, I don't know what you're seeing, but that was not me. Phoenix Path. I wasn't trying to go to Treviso. No. What the? I'm fine. Hi, Sly. Alright, hold on. I'm confusion. All right. I don't want to go to Treviso. There we go.
candle hop. They carry messages through the city. Jesus. So this is what happens when you pick Treviso over Minrathus. Huh. The killings. This is... This is Vashada. You don't forget something like this. It sticks with you. They're good, right? Now there's canary banners everywhere. Shit. Demons. Come on. Got you covered. No worries, thank you for the raid. Ho hope you are well. Alright, I'm in the middle of a fight. It's really not that important. I'm not trying to be aggressive. I was in the middle of a fight. And that was distracting. Because if I'm being aggressive, you would have got a ban. A candle hop. They carry messages through the city. Thanks, Seven. So many people here. And the Venatori think they can bully them. Let's see what they can pull with you around. with Tosh.
things ready. Souls alone as the light left. I was there, less alone. You're a spirit of compassion. My own name, but one of theirs. Three I've found, felled by demon claws, murdered. A connection I cannot see. I have impressions. But if I learn more, answers might unfold. This one, green against grey stone. Rain, nourish. How she watched it bloom. Find who she was. We've got a trail. We just need to follow it. Hector. He used to guard the pawn shop's entrance. He was waiting for someone near the market. He might still be there. One day when I'm not playing a new game and I need to concentrate, we're going to have a discussion about calling black folks, especially black women, aggressive. Because one of these days, that's going to be my fucking village and origin story, origin story and no one's going to like it. <laughs> Fuck you. Oh, now you can get a ban. Let's see what you said on Twitter so I can block you there, too. Oh, right. People I don't follow show up. Don't show up for me. So whatever you're saying is just going to go in the void. Enjoy that. Mm. So you could have just waited...
Oh, I'm leaving. You didn't fucking leave, though. But I'm real sick of this whole... Oh, if you're not nice to me, and if you don't capitulate to what I want and drop everything I want, you're aggressive. Now you're about to fucking get aggressive. Oh, that's right. You can't see the stream because I banned you. Well, that's because Samantha and I don't fucking look alike. I just need to get the shopping done. I don't like leaving the kids too long. Well, they absolutely did, and they can kiss my entire high yellow ass. That's right, but they can't see the stream because I banned them. And I've got it toggled on to if I ban you, you can't see the stream anymore. Oh, they know exactly what they're doing, V squared. Another demon killing. We need to get them away. What's funny is Sam and I are good friends. No, they knew what they were doing. They were trying to start some shit. It was like, ooh, I'll see you on Twitter. You think I care?
Charge, take this one. Golden glory. The spirit of compassion and another murder victim. This one. A roof denied. Eyes skim over. Yet a world smudged in shadow. So beautiful. Find who he was. The docks. There's a trail. Let's go. What's funnier is that my icon on Twitch is now my face. So. Getting used to the schedule? The lectures? It's fine. There's just quite a few high words and, well, I guess it's why I come down here when I have the time. It feels like I actually belong here. I'm not gonna be fucking with people today. Not today. I don't know who decided to put my go live on a fucking reddit post, but I'm going to find you. Because I'm not amused. Venatory, stop them! Um, do I have any mods present? Taru and Seven, can you note those two bands, please? Is that Hector? Because I am so not dealing with this today. Damn it. We were too late. The Venatori are going to pay. Hey, Rook, I've news about Lorelei the fence. Lorelei. She ran the pawn shop, sold things. Yes. The no, I'm, I'm, I don't know if someone actually did. You have to hurry. But we're getting a lot you of weirdos in here today. Drugs. We're on it. Could also be because we are um, streaming Veilguard.
So I'm supposed to just accept that they're better because of an accident of birth? A dragon here? I never thought. I am enjoying it, yes. Even better if these dick bags would stay out of my chat. It's like, I'm not the one that can't tell black people apart. Where am I going? Well, now they've got to wait at least five minutes to fucking talk in here if they keep trying it, so... All right, I'm confused about where the fuck I'm going. Candle hop. They carry messages through the city. Um. It's bad out here. So many days. What is this artifacting? Are you all right? Warden Rook. I'm Vesta. What happened? I'm here to help the Shadow Dragons, fighting Darkspawn in the catacombs. There weren't many when we started, but then the others said to run. Get help. We can't leave the Darkspawn if they escape into the city. Just sit tight. What in the apps? If the outcome was really dead, it wouldn't be here in about Okay. What is happening here? So, your mom wanted you to lay low, and now you're with us. And yeah, I know it's not normal. <sighs> then it looks like we please All everyone. Right. Thanks for the obvious. I'm going to close the game and reopen it really quick.
All right, let's see if that worked. A candle hop. They carry messages through the city. Yeah, I don't know what that was. Come to think of it. So, your mom wanted you to lay low, and now you're with us. And because I want. Ready if you are. Continue the punishment. <laughs> Right. Where were we? So, your mom wanted you to lay low, and now you're with us. And because I wanted to be here. <sighs> then it looks like we've pleased everyone. Isn't that novel? Yep. It's great. a lesson for getting in the way of your betters. Ambush! Ellie, are you gonna stream any of your uh, Bellguard or nah? Ready. Where in the absolute fuck did you come from? was Lorelei's. What did they do to her? So many dead, and for what? To parade their new power, in case we forget. I don't think they even care if the people they're executing are really shadow dragons. It's anyone who's ever been connected to them, or helped them.
shot. All clear. <sighs> Work. I'm sure Emrek would fill you in if you asked. Yeah, but he'd add details. All right, then. Hmm? The bare bones answer from the non necromancer. You get your parts, put the skeleton together, some fancy ritual later, and you've got a wisp inside running the show. Manfred's a wisp? Like the ones at your desk? You could make a bunch of moving skeletons? Me? No. Not without some research I don't want to do. Don't worry, those wisps are staying wisps. Good. I should probably order that pizza if I want it. It'll take about an hour, and by the time it gets here, I'll take a break. Rumored resistance group affront aspirations of hostile takeover. Oh, fun! It's nothing but canary here. And now a dragon. What's happening to this city? They've lost their homes. I wish there was something. Why did Morgan want to meet in Minrathis? Isn't she helping the Veil Jumpers in Arlathan? Indeed, but today we have a guest, and he needed the anonymity that only a city provides. Well, look who it is. Good to see you, Lace. Rook, you remember how Varric and I served the Inquisition? Well, this is Inquisitor Lavellan, the man who led us all. Andarin Artishon. I don't know what you mean by current state. I wish we could be meeting without our gods threatening to blight the world. A blight that spreads wider with each passing heartbeat. Morrigan and Harding have told me about what you've accomplished since taking over for Varric. You've put together an impressive team, and you've got the best chance, maybe the only chance, to stop Elganon and Gilane. I won't let you down. Don't worry about me. Worry about the people you've recruited, and about the people depending on you. I only sealed the breach because I had people like Cassandra, Liliana, and Cullen with me from the start. Without Dorian's magic and Josephine's diplomacy, we never would have come together to stop Corypheus. Years later, I had to disband the Inquisition. But I never lost the friends who'd gotten me through it all. Ultimately, they're the only ones you can really count on. Do right by them and you'll find your I'm not playing on console, so good team, I think. Can't tell you. And while you do so, Rook, the Inquisitor will And if you've that heard that, why are you here in a PC stream? Intact. A daunting prospect, given that most of the South is under siege by Darkspawn. It's that bad. Go ask somebody who's playing on console. The South would have collapsed completely. Uh Jamie, all the words in the you assembled your team. Jamie, all the words, all the names and places are in the banned word list because people will come in and try to spoil the game. So. I thought the gods were mostly active up here. It's really that bad in the south. Elganon and Gilanane have indeed restricted their activities. I the don't know about the forces they about console. The south, the strange I've the had people in here harassing me today, so I am greater than any blight in history. Darkspawn have cut through the center of Orle. Balroyo and Halam are barely holding out. Ferelden would have fallen already if not for help from Orzammar. 
With Denerim lost, the Fereldans are holding the line at Redcliffe. The Free Marches have the worst of it. Acting Viscount Aveline Valen led the evacuation of Kirkwall. She's taking her people and what's left of her army to help Prince Vale keep Starkhaven. Maker, we didn't know. My ma... Don't worry. I called in a favor with the Divine. Your mother's safe with some old friends. Thank you. The Inquisition might be gone, but my name still carries some weight. I've used it to get people working together where they can. Again, the South is my problem, not yours, Rook. You stop the gods, and I'll make sure the rest of Thedas doesn't fall to the Blight. Antari. If the South is in such turmoil, why come up Thank here just you. to talk? And how did you get here so fast? Did you think you were the only one to unlock the secrets of the Illuvians? Morgan helped the Inquisition use the Illuvians to travel. While I lack the Dreadwolf's veer of us, I may still. No, they're the not wearing pajamas. To be where I might do the most good. The Inquisitor asked to meet you, and I thought it might help you to meet him. I've been having trouble getting people in authority to listen to us. If you help with some of your political strength... My political strength? Devinta hates me. The Venatori helped make sure of that. And while I have a few friends in the Wardens, their leadership hasn't much cared for me since we clashed at Adamant Fortress. The Inquisitor did not come all this way to leave you with empty words, however. He brought something no one else could. A wolf statuette? Something to do with Solus? I found it right around the time Solus's ritual failed, when he was pulled into the Fade. We've examined the magic, hey, Rogan. and it's tied to the Veil. Thank you. To him, somehow. Solus is ancient, and his magic is part of him in a way far beyond that of Welcome oh, on in, Raiders. I suggest you take it to the crossroads and see if something in the lighthouse calls to it. Perhaps it will yield some insight into your new ally. Hey, Bottle. I appreciate it. Solus has been helpful while he's trapped in the Fade. But anything that can help me get inside his head will help counter him getting inside mine. Wisely spoken. Solus rarely lies directly, but he finds ways to weave the truth into a noose you find yourself wearing. Morrigan is right. Solus is dangerous. Anything that gives us some insight into his plans. He fooled us all before, and the whole world very nearly paid the price for it. We should go, Inquisitor. The armies in the south need you. Right. Harding, stay sharp. You're my eyes in the north. Always, Inquisitor. Rook, good luck. If I come across anything else that can help, you'll be the first to know. Thank you. Usually have to dodge traps and fight spiders to see this much old elven stuff. Talk to Isabella if you want to sell any of it. She'll get you a good deal. Spoken like a veteran treasure hunter. Yep. 
for gold and glory. The Lords make runs no one else can. Isabella's undies would catch fire if she saw all this. She's a canary, so yes. So why do the Lords of Fortune care enough about dragons to have a dedicated dragon hunter? Lots of great old crap ends up in dragon hordes. Why do dragons care about gathering treasure? It's not like they go to the market. Dragons like metals and gems. Anything glittery catches their eye. So they're like really large magpies? Mm hmm. Kinda. And they live for centuries. Lots of time to gather a bunch bye of. Bye bye, Rogan. Have a good one. Plus, Thanks again for the raid. I appreciate it. They could kill a dragon. But you deal with a lot of nasty traps during those treasure hunts. Yep. What's the most complicated one you've dealt with? Old Elven Armory. Had letters on tiles. Thank you, War. Probably supposed to spell out the name of a god or something. Probably? I don't read Elven. Found handholds in the ceiling and swung across. Well, that sounds more like a puzzle than a trap. Ugh. Puzzles. See, I like some puzzles, but not when they're just thrown in. Right? I ran into one while traveling with Varric. It was one of those who sits in which seat things. Ugh. Where the guy with an axe has to sit to the left of the guy who likes brandy? Oh, exactly. Who cares that much about seating arrangements? Why is that controlling the lock on an ancient treasure chest? It's Vashadon. Just pick a chair. I'm just putting this out here. I am so not in the mood for anyone's bullshit. I don't know if someone's lurking, waiting to start something in chat. But you're just getting a ban. Not fucking discussing it. I'm not dealing with it. I'm tired of whatever fucking Reddit hole you all are crawling out of. Not doing it today. And not doing it. Feel free to use the ancient elven artifacts for weight training, but nothing leaves with you, okay? Don't worry about that. The Lords of Fortune aren't thieves. I mean, aren't you, though? Nah. Anything we hunt is salvage. Old forgotten ruins and crap. And we make sure we're not screwing over a culture that lost it. That's what my mother As a developer, I can tell you no, they're probably not. How does the Ravani Royal Guard feel about the Lords of Fortune? They used to complain about us. But that was before the Antam invaded Ravain. Hmm. And now, Ravain sees the benefits of having a bunch of heavily armed people on their side. Same for the Pirate Armada. It's bigger than Ravain's official navy. But we're also helping save old artifacts. 
The Antom are burning ruins as they move south. We get artifacts out before the Antom destroy them. Magical stuff. Cultural stuff. Stuff you don't want to lose. So your mother appraises Kunari artifacts the Lords of Fortune find? Yeah. She tells them how rare something is. How much it might be worth. Also tells them if they found something cultural. Cultural? You know, important. Stuff you don't want going to some rich noble's collection. The Lords send that stuff back to the Kunari in Parvalin. They pay the Lords a finder's fee. Just a finder's fee? Yep. But the Lords at the top could be charging anything for these artifacts, and you wouldn't know. I know what happened to the last Lord who bled a contact. That's enough. The Lords are good people. They helped my mother when she came here from Kantar. She got here with nothing but me and the clothes on her back. The only skill she had was Kunari history. The Lords gave her work. We should do this again. Grab a drink, share our tallest tales. Okay, I was gonna go back to Ravane later. Got a thing to do for my mother. You can come along, if you want. Do I need to be ready for combat, or traps? Nah. All right, just let me know when. You cannot do this, Alganan. You swore that we would give up our commands when this horrific war was over. Our people need our leadership. If you're unwilling, leave. Our people must rebuild, and we must help unite them. So, we did not fight for freedom, but to conquer this land and our own. We fought to win, and now the Evanuris are as gods. I do not answer to Mithal's annoying lapdog. The people are afraid. They must believe in something. They need strength. And wisdom. They need gods who can protect them. We are not gods. You will learn that. Every lapdog hides a wolf inside. That was strange. They were speaking Alvin, but I understood it. I believe we have experienced a memory in each of our native languages. Not just any memory. One of the Dread Wolves. And the mages who declared themselves my gods? Well, mine and Davrin's, and Rook's. They were supposed to protect people. Instead, they seized power. Assholes. It was so... mundane. Nothing grand or cosmic. No setting fire to the sun, just talking. Politics. 
I wish they were monsters. Something grand and terrible. Seeing them like that, they're no better than to venture nobles. But no worse, either. They were people. And people can let you down. All right. What else can we take from this memory? Elgrinon was hungry for power. Did anything he could to get it, and to hold on to it. Then Solus, furious at Elgonon's installing himself as a despot, started his rebellion. There's another moving part in this. Mithal. She was keeping the peace. Mithal and Solus were close. The Inquisition found a temple to Mithal, and there were wolf statues everywhere. Then she sides with Elgonon over him. A betrayal. I think... I think I get where Mithal is coming from. Really? Well, you've just finished some big war, everyone is exhausted, and now Elganon won't give up power? If Mithal sided with Solus, would Elganon have backed down? Not a chance. It would have led to another war. Mithal tried to keep the peace. And Solus must see that, but still can't accept that she chose peaceful politics over his ideals. Perhaps these murals aren't simply memories. They're what Solus wishes to forget. His regret. That means they're a way to learn his weak points. Why are we worried about Solus? He's trapped. Right. But the Dread Wolf was the god of trickery. He's looking for a way out. Bet on it. Meanwhile, keep your eyes open in the crossroads. If there's a way to restore the rest of these murals, Solus would have kept it in his hideaway. It'd be nice to get inside his head for a change. Nev, settling back in. More or less. Lots to catch up on, but when isn't there? I'm ready to get back to work. If we could skip the personal catch-up. Not the day for it. Take all the time you need. I cannot say. Who created you? I cannot say. What can you say? I cannot say. Right. Deserve that. Got the Archive Spirit working, I see. Rook, you're here. And I did. Sort of. A little bit. It appears, but it won't tell me anything. You simply ask the wrong questions. A common affliction of the weak-minded. Also that, it's kind of mean. Just insult it right back. Assuming you know how to insult a spirit? I've never thought about it. H how would you do that? Emmerk might know. Hmm, that is an idea. Sirian learned a lot, taught me a lot about these archives. They have, well, not thoughts like us, but sort of pathways, I guess. They can only respond to specific questions worded in specific ways. So, if you're powerful, like almost God-level powerful, how would you talk to someone you see as lesser? Really condescendingly, based on experience so far. Right! You wouldn't ask questions, you'd tell them what to do, so let's try that. Archive, tell me who built you. One of the greatest of Elvenan, a steward of her glory. Truly, I was blessed to bathe in his warmth. Anaris built me, and to him 
I shall someday return. You mean... the Forgotten One? I cannot say. Good point. That was us. What do you mean by that was us? The Dalish called them that. Forgotten Ones, I mean. I don't know what they were before. You weren't supposed to speak their names or else they'd come for you. Remember the nursery rhymes? You know, unlike the upstanding Gilanane or Elgernon. So who knows what they really were? The Forgotten Ones. They used to say Solus was one, so best case scenario, like him? Worst case, well, you heard it talk. Right. So this thing's dangerous if it belonged to one of them. Could be, but still important and invaluable. Everything Anaris knew, this thing knows, and my people deserve to know. If I can get it to tell me... Archive, tell me about the Evanuris. A group of cowards hiding behind their more powerful magic and superior numbers. Their jealousy of Anaris was palpable. Their war is unending, but Anaris will prevail. Archive, tell me about the Dreadwolf. An ideologue and a fool who will soon pay the price. When Anaris dispatches the Evanuris, he will spare a thought for Fen Harel. You've got a chance to learn more about our people. Go for it. Just be careful and try not to break anything. Right. Thanks, Rook. All thanks must be given to Anaris, for he will cast down the oppressive Evanuris and take his rightful place. What a shame I can't stay longer. Good luck. Appreciate the support. You know, we have more comfortable rooms and basically infinite space, so why, uh... Why does the trained assassin prefer a quiet, unassuming spot with good choke points? Guess you just answered that question. Besides, I'm closer to the coffee. Rook, I was thinking of taking us on for a walk. He could use the exercise. Chance to stretch his wings. Thought you'd like to come along. No one said saving the world would be easy. Just wish it were easier.
If you want a more comfortable space, I'm sure there's empty rooms we haven't found yet. I'd rather be somewhere I can smell soil and plants. Familiar, you know? I do. We bolstered guards along the ridge. We've got the high ground out there. Davrin, if a person is blighted and doesn't go through whatever wardens go through, how long? Depends on the person. With the changes to the blight, the answer's even more uncertain. Right. Well, another thing we can't predict. We're on fire. Look out! Let's get going. I've been thinking. Lancet and Remy used special food to train the Griffins. Said it was the fastest way to start a bond. Right. The, uh, uh what do you call it? Turlum? That's it. And Ginger wore truffles were the Griffins' favorite treats. They grow around ruins. We're going to teach Asan how to find some.
How did you end up with the Grey Wardens? Grew up in a Dalish clan. I'd hear all these stories about things that happened thousands of years ago. The Dalish do love their history. Except I wanted to make history. Didn't fit in. Got bored, so I went looking for adventure. How'd that go over with your clan? Poorly. They felt like I rejected them. Did you? Yeah, I suppose. <sighs> clan life wasn't for me. I had to get away. So that... And what happened? You're out in the world looking for adventure? Got my ass kicked. Went broke. I couldn't go crawling back to my clan of failure. Doubt they'd take me back. It forced me to figure out what I was good at. Always had a knack for hunting. Not a truffle, that's a nug. You'll get fleas. <laughs> At least he's having fun. Through this, purrs when you scratch him. Maybe we can speed things up by helping him. Let's search the bushes. Look around for truffles. Was a thorn? Keep looking. <sighs> Nug droppings. Ugh. The Nugs pretty much own Arlithan Forest. Harder than it looks. It's fleas, isn't it? What I tell you? Actually, I think it's a truffle. Huh. Maybe the nugs like truffles. Could Asar know that if you follow them, you might find truffles? Are you really that smart, boy? Seems pretty clever to me. If only you'd be clever enough to listen. Well, you're still getting to know each other. Remember, tell them. <sighs> Remy Remy was probably right. Remember how she said he needed a lighter touch? If I go soft on him, the world would chew him up. Let's give you both a chance and see if he can find any more of these. How? Find some nugs, see what happens. So how did you go from hunter to slayer of monsters? Uncle Eldrin. An old elf I knew growing up. When I was a kid, I'd hunt just about anything. Rabbits, deer, fox. Eldrin gave that purpose. Taught me the way of three trees. The way of the arrow, way of the bow, way of the wood. Hmm. That sounds noble. Eldrin taught me to hunt the unnatural so the natural can thrive. Be a force for good. Besides, it was either that or star. Monsters paid good coin. But why become a Grey Warden? If you were making money on your own. I didn't leave my clan to get rich. I had to prove it was all worth something. I needed a cause. There are easier causes than dying in the deep roads. Darkness is a sparring partner. The greater the shadow you confront, the stronger you are for winning. Till you meet one you can't beat. Haven't yet. Oh, we're just cocky, aren't we? There. 
think Hassan's got something. Why don't you take a look? I'll be damned. Follow the nugs. Like I said, he's a clever one. Might make a tracker out of you yet. Hungry? <sighs> what? It's ginger wart. Eat it. Remember, light touch. I mean, mmm, it's dessert fit for a prince. See? Being too harsh could make him more stubborn. And save his life. With Lancet and Remy gone, if something happens to me, he'll have to stand on his own. So don't let anything happen to you. We're both wardens. Deaths around every corner. Not that I don't enjoy punching it squarely in the face. Two or three times, just to be sure. Mm-hmm. But you can't beat back death forever. Okay, boy. That's enough for one day. But he's having fun. He overeats, and you'll find out how fun Griffin Puke is. Hassan, you heard him. Let's go. Hey, Kelly. Yeah, the uh, Veil Guard color scheme is very purple. I'm gonna pick up the new quest and call it because I've been on almost seven hours. A candle hop. They carry messages through the city. Venatori causing trouble, and the people of Minrathus are desperate for any help. Alright, let's see if we can do this. I'm not tired, I'm just hungry, and pizza's on the way. So I'm gonna get to this new quest and call it. Uh, mods only. Can you see who's on that we could raid?
if I can get to this ritual site. Okay. Let's get to this mission. I'll save. And then I might come back. I don't know. I might start my offline game. Or we're gonna have some combat first. All right, we're gonna save here and then I think we'll go raid technique. Opening up Frank's channel. Thanks, Benka. This 
So, if you're not a sub, you're a hi, how do you, what you have? I may come back after I've had pizza and a break. I might not. I don't know, because I've been on seven hours. So, we'll see what Frank's up to in Veilguard, and uh, I will catch some of you later. Bye, y'all.